Good afternoon, everybody. It is that time once again. Hey, Lonix, Mesa, Vola, hey, Hitter, Davey, McNugget, BL, hey, James, hey, Doug, better. Yeah, we got the free fly going on. And, uh, James, I got a total of three yesterday that was during stream, and I did one after. And, uh, that's, that's about it so far. And if I've done my numbers right, which, you know, I, <laughs> I probably haven't, um, I'm at three trade guides and one misc guide. Hey, crumpet! You're up early, dear. Ooh, all right. Let's jump on in. Oh, no sleep. Oh, dear. Oh, I am so sorry, hon. Hey, Driz. The day. The day. We're going to do more of the guides. Let's see. Ba -ba -da -ba -da. Average space industries don't come. You know, I feel like I need to make uh, access to the whole guide page a little bit easier to find. All right, let's see. Find a guide. Ba -ba 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 -ba. Let's get set up. Basics trading misc. And we are available. We are available. Uh, Driz, not yet. I, I have not, uh, I have not got there yet. I am at three for trade, one for misc, and, uh, zero for the basics. Yeah, see, I got to teach Crumpet how to do the funky landings. Sorry, I'm just making sure I've got everything set up properly. There we go. And I feel really bad about this guide system because I've seen a lot of people who uh, have had issues where they have, you know, been sitting in the guide section for hours and haven't got a single thing. And it does seem odd to have an event where your only chance at success entirely relies on other people. So I do, I do kind of feel like it, it, you know, encourages gaming the system, you know? Like, even if you're teaching in good faith, I still like it really, really requires knowing people, you know? Ooh, Lonix. Lonix, that sounds like a heck of a, of a ride, man. Enjoy it. Lonix, while you're there, you should see if you can swing by, uh, by Manchester and uh, visit some offices. Hey, Sibo. Hey, Deplorable. Yeah, Sibo, they make it really hard to find anyone, you know? Yeah, Dark Matter? What's it, uh, what's it doing for you this time? Just, in general, bad servers?
All right. What do we have here? Well, Driz, I don't even know if we get the paints until after it's over, you know? Yeah, Tarak Wade, good to see you guys. Hey there, Riri. And if you're referring to me, I have never been skydiving. I try not to fall at, uh, you know, fast speeds. Ah, Linux, I gotcha. I gotcha. Well, that's, that's fair. That's fair. Unknown. Come on. Come on back. But yeah, Todd Crumpet had a fancy land last night. I figured that's what I'll do for the misc section. You know, is uh, teach people how to do the fancy landing stuff. So, if you want to get a guide in and, uh, you know, do some flying together for a little bit to learn how to, to land fancy, look me up. It's also a very hard system to find people on. So, Lonix, what are all you guys doing there while you're, uh, while you're, you know, hopping across the UK? Your insurance claim has been sent. Oh, crap, you did good. You did good. Ow. Sorry, I just need my desk. I figure we could probably practice some landing while we're waiting for something to come through. Or maybe we could just do some quick trade runs. Why not? Maybe someone wants to learn some trade as well. Like, are we supposed to get the skins as soon as we get the five guides, or do they award afterwards, or what? I haven't, I haven't really been, you know, uh, they've been rather vague on all the information about it, you know? Yeah, Bruno, the problem is, Bruno, like, right now, there's just an absolute slew of everyone trying to be a guide. There's a lot more guides than there are guidees. And uh, at the same time, they don't really make it obvious where the guide system is. So the people who need it the most have no idea on where to find it. Hey, Sarone. Good to see you, man. And a lot of sightseeing sounds nice. I'd like to go just to visit the, uh... Oh, God, what was it, The Bluebell Railway? And 318? Moon! That... That bites. Don't tell me that. That's awful. That bites. Hey, hell yeah. Uh, honestly, man, like, either Lorville or Area 18. Um, I like Area 18. Lorville's probably gonna be a little bit closer to the other places. But, uh, literally anything but Orzen, really. Yeah, and Tarak, that's how I feel. Like, it should be, like, an all-year thing. But yeah, I had Crumpet do an unmanned landing with her caterpillar and everything. She was real good at it. Learned really quick. Uh, Lonix, it's a preservation railway. Or at least it was. I don't know if it's still around. 
had a lot of your, you know, historical saddle tank engines and whatnot. Yeah, see, Driz, like, I'm wondering if they're going to do it the way they used to, where it was, uh... They had this a while back, where you could get stuff for the, the guide system, but it was, like, all fighter skins, so I just didn't really participate. Because, let's be honest, how much time do you guys see me spend on a fighter? Oh, <laughs> thank you, Crumpet. Yeah, see what Recline said. That's how I always felt. Ah, Lonix, that's fair. That's fair. I'm just happy to know that it's still around. Yeah, but Ducky, Hurston's there, you know? Like, the Hurston family. Sometimes the weather just kills my frames. But yeah, so, like, I'm really hoping they decide to, to look at this whole thing, because, like, let's say, let's say you're a collector. Let's just say you're a big old collector and you want every skin. It's going to take an absolute minimum, an absolute minimum of 25 hours to get every skin over the course of two weeks, because you have, you have two weeks to get these. Two weeks. And, uh, you know, that's not including sitting there waiting for someone to get, you know, to choose you. That's just, that's just the time it takes to, uh, you know, to, to spend playing with minimum 30 minute sessions. Now, obviously, it's going to take you a lot longer than 30 minutes to, to learn some of these things. Uh, yes, Lonix, they are absolutely beautiful. They are the shiny, brushed metal steel look of like the Meridian skin with uh, teal accents. Ah, <laughs> James, yeah. You know, I come from the state of Walton. Hey, Squirrel Lord. Yeah, exactly, Kurushima. And the thing is, like, you can still teach your friends things. Like, as long as you are doing it in good faith, it doesn't matter who you're teaching. Like, as long as you're actually doing it. And I mean, yeah, you could just hang out and game for a while. But I feel like if you're going to do it, you might as well do it in good faith and, and teach. Maybe I'm being a bit of a Boy Scout about this. But, um... Yeah, like, you go in there right now, and it's going to be a hundred plus people available to teach you how to trade, you know? Yeah, exactly, Sibo. A lot of people aren't really engaging. It's like, way to make a user-required event during a lull where there's going to be a minimum amount of users. Like, what were you guys thinking? Uh, yeah, Lonix. Uh, actually, I've got the link in the, the stream description for the Founders Festival. And you can see what I'm talking about like, with the skins and the guide system and like all that. Oh, um, Moon, remind me to do that in about an hour. Uh, actually, maybe two hours. I need to look that up again. I keep forgetting if it's one hour after food or two hours after food. Actually, I should probably set, like, a, a timer or something. Yeah, you see, Lonix, I'm working on the Caterpillar skin. I've got three trade guides under my belt and one miss guide for the MSR. Really, Driz? Four from the top. Nice. You 
Yeah, Tarok, that's what I want to see. Ah, <laughs> Crumpet. Oh, are they ducky? Did they just announce it? Wait, one? All you need is one? Hold on, hold on, ducky, you got a link? Did they just post that? Hey, Chase. Oh, Lonic, sure you can. Oh, yeah, Star, that Valkyrie skin is beautiful. Hold on, hold on, logs. Let me let me go. Let me go find that. Let me go find that. Let me go find that. I assume. I assume it's on. Did they make it a com link? Is it under Spectrum? Well, if that's the case, then where in the world is my mouse? Guys, I'm getting old. I'm getting to the point where I can't find my mouse. Ah, thank you, Ducky. I'll put it up in Discord. And yeah, James, I'll check my skins. I'll have to go to Art Corp. To check in game. Let me just check my account on the website right quick, though, to make sure they haven't already like attributed them. They have not. Aha! Thank you, Moon. Yes, yes, yes. Let the link go through. All right, let me just read this. All right, we're seeing a healthy number of new players successfully funnel through the guide system in the thousands already. Thank you to veteran players. We've been monitoring closely and have identified an imbalance in the ratio between guides and new players, which can make it very difficult to unlock numerous rewards, which doesn't fly. <laughs> I, I see what they did there. Uh, we have made some adjustments to the event rewards effective immediately. Previously, the Beanie and Cap rewards were awarded for completing one, three, and six successful guide sessions. We are updating this to one, two, and three. Previously, you had to complete five successful guide sessions in a single category to unlock the category's paint. We are updating this so you only need to complete a single one guide session per category. Previously, the paint reward would only be given to the veteran slash guide. We are updating this so the paint reward will now be given to both the guide and the recruit. Paint rewards are rewarded based on two criteria. The guide session must have at least 30 minutes, and you are rewarded based on the category endorsement you receive at the end of the session. This does mean that if you helped a new player with multiple categories, as long as they endorse you as such, you can earn multiple rewards from a single session. All of the above is retroactive, so if you completed a successful guide session already, fear not! They will count using the above criteria already. Uh, let's see. Separately, want to be clear, we are aware of the challenge that simply time rewards. All right. Neat. Neato. Torpedo. Well, how about that? All right. Crumpet. Crumpet. My dear, sweet crumpet. Yeah, see, Crumpet, you get all those. You get, you get, you get, Crumpet, you want to teach me about mining? Uh, Driz, I believe so. You should get one. Crumpet will get one. Oh, that's beautiful. Oh, death. Yeah, like, I, uh... I'm going to be honest, like, I, I use it from time to time, but not, you know, a lot. Well, hold on. Let's just, you know. That's nice. You know what? Like, okay. This is this is going to be a, an, an insultment, a, a, a complicult. The thing where you make an insult and a compliment at the same time. As tone deaf as CIG is at times, or like out of touch. It's nice that when actually given criticism, like valid criticism, they go, hold on. Maybe they're right about something. That's it. Backhanded compliment. That's what I'm looking for. 
Hey, Phaedrus. That's nice. That's nice. Way to go, CIG. Though that does encourage a lot more people to sign up to be a guide e since you get the skin anyway. Maybe I could get that 600 eye skin. Just have a five hour session. Go run around on the 400 eye, find the river, go mining by the river. Shoot somebody. Sell a box. Hey, Dragdos. Although, I still... Okay, alright. I want I want you guys' opinion on something. Um... I still kind of want to go for the... For the most trade guides. I know earlier I was saying maybe I shouldn't. Or, you know, I shouldn't. Because I've already got a caterpillar and that way someone else could get another caterpillar. But I kind of want to. Like... Is that wrong? Is that mean? Should I just not? Hey, Lobby! Really, Ducky? Star? I don't I don't know if you're here, Star. Or I don't know if you're still here, but... Uh, sounds like you and Ducky could uh, share a common goal. Yeah, see, Keel, I'm gonna side up as a, uh, as a touring guide and get people to strip and take drugs to get them into the fish tank at the Mile High Club. <laughs> yeah, Tarok, I gotta say, um, I gotta say, they, they, they did well. Um, they did good. Oh, Tony! Yeah, man! Like, okay, so, Tony, it is gonna be a little hard to you right now. You know, cuz, uh... We're on the cusp of a new patch. And you get the free fly going on, so... Your whole, like... Population makeup is gonna be a little skewed. Um... But... You know, honestly, just reaching out in in-game chat, you know? Like, here we go. Like, the Stu Strip guy is like, hey, man, can I get a party invite from Electric Tsunami? That's a name, Electric Tsunami. Just, you know, it's, uh, just throw things down in chat, see if people want to get together. And if you have a good enough time, then you go, hey, want to be friends? Like, here's my, my Discord deets. Or, you know, I don't know. Oh god, what was that? TeamSpeak. Yeah, you guys remember TeamSpeak? Does anybody still use TeamSpeak? You see, Phaedrus, I don't know. I don't know about the trade guy. Like, there's enough room for multiple trade guys, you know? Oh, thank you, Tarek. Oh, Squirrel, you're good, man. I was just thinking about trying to go for, like, the most trade guides. Oh, Lamy, I'm glad you asked. Uh, actually, Lamy, they might still be having their sale right now. They were having a 10% off thing. I think they're usually $250. Um, but I think it might be 10% off right now. They're quite fun. Hey, diapers. You know, Diapers, it is. They just had a new announcement. You only need one guide now to get the skin. And both you and the uh, the Recruit E get the skin. So nice. Very nice. The vent. What are we venting about, Sibo? Oh, oh Ventri... Wow. Ventrilo? Wow. <laughs> And yes, Driz. Yeah, this is the pirate skin. Driz, uh, by by chance, Driz, are you looking to unlock the pirate caterpillar? Because that would be, you know, combat, and we could do some some combat training 
in uh, in Arena Commander with the Pirate Swarm. Oh, Tarok, I miss... I miss MS and Messenger. Uh, yeah, Driz, the Pirate Caterpillar. You unlock being able to purchase it on the website by beating uh, Pirate Swarm. Yeah, Eric? You in, uh, you in game? I mean, like, are you able to play? I will totally run a guide session of combat and do Pirate Swarm. And, uh, negative, the astronaut suit is not available yet. That'll be a future subscriber thing. The current subscriber thing are the bobbleheads, which I went ahead and subscribed, still have not got mine yet. I really just want to put it on the side of my, uh, my caterpillar dash. What am I looting for? Yeah, you see, Squirrel? You get that pack, and then you do the combat, and bam, you've got a new skin for your Gladius. Oh, Florine. Yeah, you see, Eric, I subscribed later. Yeah, Endless? Oh, man, Endless. I don't think the Pirate Cat ever actually goes on sale. Like, it's pretty much always locked at that price. Is it? Is it still at $2.95? Because technically, that's cheaper than a regular cat. The cat is now at three thirty, which is silly. So so silly. Yeah, Driz, that's no rush, man. Like, it doesn't have to be right now, you know? Uh, Man's a Fish, it'll probably... Okay, at the very latest, will be November. But it might go for sale before that. Oh! Wait, Mike, Mike, it's supposed to unlock instantly. Did you do it single player or multiplayer? Because it has to be done in multiplayer. Nice, Sebo. Still 295. Ooh, that sun. All right, back to our corp we go. Hey, Crazy Ivan. Heck yeah, man. Thank you. Oh, thank you, man. Heck yeah, dude. Oh, thank you so much. Well, I don't know why Stream Elements isn't uh, isn't popping up with that. Stream Elements, are you are you okay? Do you wanna do you wanna do something for my for my guy? Thank you, Ivan. Heck yeah! Thank you, man. That's that's my my fancy eating money, you know. Yeah, Moon, I don't I don't know what's going on. They've been having a lot of issues as of late. Like they had an update a few weeks back and it seems like everything's been really slow since then. Hold on. I'm just I'm going to check something. Yeah, Crumpet, get some sleep, dear. I'll be here when you wake up. Got some Orville to watch. Some Owl House. The boys. 
take your pick when you wake up. Get some sleep. Sleep in. Sleep well. Oh, did they, Eric? That is nice. And Mike, if you want, like, I mean, I could... I could run it through multiplayer with you, if you want. We'll knock it out in about 20 minutes. That's it, Crumpet. Hoot hoot. There's a, there's a character on Owl House named Hootie, who is my absolute favorite thing. You know, Alphonse, that's a good question. I don't... I don't know. Um... I don't know. And yeah, Death, I'm, I'm really hoping there's a big enough push that it actually gets brought back or someone else gets to pick it up somewhere, you know, but... I know Disney never releases their claws... from anything. Oh, is it 20k? Thank you, G-Hammer. Also, G Hammer, good to see you. How's the uh, how's the game treating you so far? Do you find yourself running up that hill? Didn't use any referral code, but gee, what about the free dragonfly? I guess you could always make another account if you wanted the free dragonfly. Oh no, uh, Chibi, all you have to do is beat it. Doesn't matter what you beat it in. It unlocks the, uh, the Gladius and the Caterpillar. Ah, oh, gee, that's how it goes. You know, when I got my start, G-Hammer, all we had was, like, the, uh, the Pirate Swarm. And, the uh, only place you could land were these tiny landing pads in space. Didn't have any moons, didn't have any, like, little stations. They were just, like, little floaty pads. So it was a little bit easier back then. No, oh, death, that's fair. Like, I've heard good things about Amphibia. I've just never watched it, you know? And honestly, uh, Mr. Pliss, you'll probably make a lot more money in that Titan than you will a, uh, a whole A right now. Because, uh, honestly, trade is really bad, and it won't be fixed until 318, which isn't coming for several months. So, um, I think you're going to make a lot more money shooting things than you will trading things. <laughs> yeah, I'll bet. When did you join up? Yeah, Mesa. Cry Astro. You know what I miss about Cry Astro? They used to call you out. You know? Like, you'd roll up, and it's like, you seem to be low on fuel. Why not refuel at Cry Astro? I gotcha. Well, Dragnos, um... So the thing about the larger ships... Uh, they're not actually doing individual SCUs. They're doing, like, crates that hold the individual ones. So they'll be in, like, 32 SCU, uh, like, shipping containers. So you're actually going to be able to load 32 SCU at a time. Now, unfortunately, the Caterpillar is very awkwardly designed where it cannot hold those crates. I don't know if they're going to redesign the Caterpillar or make, like, a separate, you know, loading crate style for those or, or what. But, um, the Caterpillar does not have that yet. But, uh, yeah, for mass storage like that, I doubt you're going to be doing individual boxes. You'll be using the 32 SCU container system. Oh, 
Well, Terra, hopefully, you know, all of them. Uh, yes, Dragnos. Yeah, that's what the raft carries. Huh. Hey, thank you, Mac Attack. Heck yeah, man. Thanks for subscribing. That's weird. Stream element shows up for that, but it's not... You know what? Once I land, I'm going to jump into stream elements right quick and uh, uh, just do a quick update and make sure it's refeeding what it's supposed to for overlays. Every now and then it needs a jump start. Hey, John. How you doing today? Casabar, good to see you. Good morning, morning, morning. So, good news for those who, uh, who are, you know, trying to do the guide thing. Turns out now you only need a one. Oh, what? If they just give me the cap ship hanger, come on. But yeah, you only need one guide now, and both you and the guide E get the skin. Alright, we're gonna try something dumb. We're gonna try something really dumb. Can you land sideways in the cap ship hangers with the caterpillar? I'm pretty sure you can. Since, you know, got the bed red X right there. Congratulations. Hmm? Oh, there it goes. There it goes. Wow, that was late. Wow, that was so late. Stream elements? Are, are you are you okay? Are you are you feeling slow today? I think it's just getting overloaded or something. Hey! Right there! Ah. Heck yeah, man! Thank you, Red Deer! It's not... It's not playing the, the, the gift animation! What in the world? It did it yesterday! Stream Elements is having a conniption. And yeah, Gyaza, you can you can be in true, man. You can be a, a what do you call that? Um uh, Beards of Antiquity. There it is. There it is. Yeah, I think I think it's just having an absolute fit today. The stream elements just under a lot of stress. Yeah, Revixi, I think so. I think you're right. I'm going to refresh it right quick, though, just to see if it'll catch up a little bit faster. Uh, once I sell this cargo, though. But yeah, Yaza, um, you can sign up for it. You can have someone teach you anything. Hey, Profeta. Good to see you, man. That's it, I bet. I always like the, uh, the Miss Frizzle style, you know, take chances, make mistakes, get messy. All right. I don't even know why I'm trading. It's just, it's just fun. It's relaxing. It's what I do, you know? It is... 
enjoyable. I also really enjoy Grim Hex's do 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 do. In fact, we're gonna buy some uh some uh, so what do you call that? Wow, those animations are delayed. Okay, okay. Let me just let me just buy the scrap and I'm gonna refresh. I'm gonna refresh stream elements here, because it is having a time. It is having a time. Uh, stream elements. Okay, hold on. Let me just... I'll get in the elevator. Alright, come here, stream elements. Sorry, guys. I'm working on the technical difficulties. Because I hate for it to, like, you know, when you do something and it pops up... 20 minutes later, you know? Um I'm not I'm not a fan of that. Okay, let's see. Uh-huh, uh-huh. All right, so I'm going to run a quick test just to see how long it takes for something to come through. Okay, that went through. And then if we stack a... Alright, we're gonna test a community gift, whatever that is. Okay, that worked. Okay, sorry. I'm just saving that and pushing that out. I think Stream Elements is just having... Wow, that doesn't, that doesn't even want to save. Okay. There we go. Yeah, Stream Elements is just under some, uh, some stress today. It will simply have to do. Oh, thank you, David. You know, I, uh, I only ever got to see, like, one episode of that show, I think. I don't even remember the bus driver, but I will take it as a compliment. And you know, Ahmed, one of my favorite things to do, honestly, is to try to run away from pirates as much as I can. Like, it's it's so fun. Like, I finally had someone shoot at me the other day. And, uh, you know, it was an experience. I loved it. Because, like, I love trading, but, you know, I also enjoy some of the spice that comes with it. And, um... Just don't get shot at enough, you know? Now watch, I'm going to get shot at and go, Oh no, I take back what I said. You are, Casabare. Oh, Casa Bear, that's it. That's it. You get the, uh, you get the PBS treatment. How about that? This stream is brought to you by viewers like you. Thank you. <laughs> yeah, Dimensions. It's the capital ship hangar. For whatever reason, they let me land in it. I wanted to land in a regular hangar, but CIG denies me fun. Hmm. 
Yeah, Alphonse, which, uh, which one was that? And yeah, Dimensions. It's going to be fine. We're supposed to get that, what, next year? And see, Tarak, I would greatly enjoy that. Because you get the whole, like, fish school defense thing where there's so many of you that, you know, they can only grab one or, or two. Alright, I probably won't hit a rock for a while. Let's take this out to Creel 5. Sell some scrap. You know dimensions, I know that feeling. I remember when I first looked at Star Citizen, I was 24 years old. Now I'm in the autumn years of 32. Yeah, see Alphonse, I don't I don't actually know that character. You know, Dimensions, I think I met him, or at least someone very similar to his age bracket, in, um, at CitizenCon 2018, because he was in his 70s, and that was a very sobering conversation. That's it, Unlimited. Ah, oh, yeah, this was a, yeah, this was a different, different person, different person. I, uh, this gentleman was, uh, at least from the States. Well, Squirrel, that's the thing. They're getting their hands on everything. Wait, Profeta, really? Oh, hold up, hold on. Profeta, let me check something. I might not have even told YouTube that I was streaming uh, Star Citizen. Let me just double check. Okay, so I have a question, if, if any of you guys, uh, stream on YouTube. Are you supposed to put tags in for when you live stream? Because... I never have. Well, where are your dimensions? And Parker, I would love to find out. Probably just scrap. But who doesn't like scrap, you know? But yeah, if anybody wants to do a combination of Pirate Swarm to unlock the Pirate Caterpillar slash Gladius and uh, work on their their combat uh, guide request, please let me know. I am all up for that. Yeah, you see, Profeta, I, I I just went and updated it and put in the tag for Star Citizen, so maybe it'll actually, you know, recognize that. Hey, 
Hey, hey, Russell. Oh, yeah, I was just wondering if it actually shows under, like, a Star Citizen category. Oh, Dimensions, like, anyone is more than welcome to, you know, come along with. Like, I don't play solo exclusively or anything. Although I do find sometimes it's it gets hard to try to communicate with, like, multiple groups. <laughs> For sure, yeah. Oh, did it, Prof- Okay, so, turns out, Profeta, I've been doing this wrong for, like, a year, and I just need to actually put Star Citizen in the tag section so YouTube knows to put me in the Star Citizen section. <laughs> I'm bad. I'm bad. I'm, I'm bad at streaming, guys. I am incredibly bad at streaming. <sighs> I've only been getting it wrong for a year. Hey, Christian, that's it. Hugbees. Ah, uh, Hugbees all around. Oh, this should be all right. Actually, I might scuff on this. We're gonna find out. We're gonna find out. No scuff! Haha! Oh yeah, Lonix, that one I do select. No, Christian, you're never too late. Yeah, wait, I'm I'm gonna be honest, man. Like, I stream on YouTube. I don't know how to find streams on YouTube. Hey, thank you, Profeta. Heck yeah, man. Welcome about it. Welcome to the ooh 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 ah uh, ah. Uh. Are those touching? That is not by, like, an inch. However, that one... Uh... Wow. I feel like a piece of deli-sliced ham would have to suck in its gut to get between there. That is close. Wait, Lonix, what? How do you... Hold on, what is... Tell me more. And hey, Dell. Good to see you, bud. Oh, sure you can, Dell. Yeah, Lonix, like, uh... It, uh, like, you know, where it says, like, game category... That one I always set to Star Citizen, but I've never actually used the tags until about 10 minutes ago. Well, That's it, Randir. No sparks. Oh, what? How do you say it? I can't park here. I mean, I can, I can go. Tell you what, I'll go after I sell all my scrap. Hmm. <clears throat> Yeah, Randir. Oh, thank you, Lonix. I will take a look-see in just a second on my cellular telephone. Yeah, Giazza. I was uh, I was practicing my my doctor girlfriend voice earlier. I had to drive to the store. Unfortunately, as I was pulling in. I realized that my window was still down, and I think somebody heard me, and that was very awkward. Alright, alright, let me take a look here. 
<laughs> yeah, yeah, it locks. Yeah, I've got that one filled out. I don't know if I've got it done, you know, right. Oh, Giaza. Easily. Like, seriously. You guys ever want anything done, like... I'll do it, you know? Like, ultimately, Giaza, that's something I would love to do. Like, honestly, I should probably just list something on, on Fiverr or whatever, you know? But, um... I would, uh... Yeah, I would I would do it in a heartbeat. Well, you know, Granulus, technically train surfing would fall under misc. Vehicle selected. Stand by. Ah, nice Lonix. And yeah, motor, I'm ready for the wipe. It'll be a fresh start. Ooh, Sasquatch, that's a good question. That's a good question, Sasquatch. It really weighed. Nice. Okay, so it turns out I have been bad this whole time and just not tagging things at all. Oh, yeah, Prophet. Yeah, you'll have to give me a bit to get to those. Ah, Prophet. Aha, that is. That's a list of tags. Thank you, man. Thank you so much. I, uh... I'm gonna be honest. I am really bad. At, uh, at advertising or like, you know, setting things up like that. Uh, dimensions, they're wiping money and items and unfortunately ships fall under items. However, they are not wiping reputation. So uh, if you max your rep with a place, in 317.2, you will have the same rep. And hey, Skitch! Skitch, we're still trying to do the guide stuff today. Hey, James. Yeah, man. So, so James, 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 James. Jimmy James. So, and everyone else who hasn't heard yet, they've changed the guide system. You now only need one guide to get the appropriate skin. And uh, if they take you off for multiple options and you get the multiple skins and both you and the guidee get the skin. And that way you can pull a Dove commercial or a Buffalo Bill and love the skin you're in. And yeah, Lotus, free fly right now. Uh, in fact, uh, Mr. Lotus, there is a referral bonus if you use a referral code when you buy the game. Uh, both you and the person who referred you get a dragonfly for free. Which is like a $40 hoverbike. Hey, Pagan. Good to see you, man. Let's see, where are we going to go? Ah, oh, Dimensions is fine. I got gas. I mean, <laughs> you know what I mean. Hey, Burger. Oh, Sketch, have you not seen? Uh, Sketch, click, um, all right, if you, if you look at, like, the, the description, 
uh, stream description. If you look at the street, street, uh, stream description, there is a, uh, a link to the Foundation Festival. One, the skins are beautiful, brushed stainless steel and teal. And uh, you can look through there and see what all sections of the guide system correlate with uh, what ship skin. And if you have the most guides in a particular section, you actually win the ship as well. Uh, Profeta, it depends. Um, if you're doing the missions by yourself, it can go up fairly quickly. Now, gr granted, if you're doing, like, the higher-end bounty missions, it'll take, you know, probably a few dozen. Ah, oh, Pagan, that would be nice. I feel like that would really mix it up, too, because, like, I'm not, I'm not knocking you guys. You guys have been excellent, but I feel like I've only got the four guides that I've got in because I have, you know, friends and people like you guys who can, uh, you know, go, wow, I want to do that. I want to help him out. And, you know, there are people who are excellent guides who will never get someone because, you know, they're not, I don't know, you know, streaming it or whatever. Like, there are some people who are amazing at it who, who just never get anybody. So I'm glad they're definitely lowering the, uh, the amount of people. And Giazza, I want you to know that song is what I use, like, when I feel myself getting, like, drowsy or low energy. Like, it's just such a fun song, you know? And Wolf, good to see you, man. Oh, Bagan, I don't, I don't know about YouTube famous, but... Uh, Profeta, what, uh, was there a particular rep that you're after, like, with a, a particular company? Because you track them under, like, the whole Delphi thing. And, uh, like, so, for example, with Ling Family Hauling, I am maxed out. With Crusader Security, uh, I'm, I'm still working on that. Bounty Hunters Guild, I'm at level 5. CDF, uh, I don't think the CDF likes me. Actually, they do like me. Red Wind, I'm still working on my level 1s. Vaughn... Vaughn and I don't really... You know, I'm a trainee assassin. An assassin -y. Wait, no, that means I'm the guy getting murked over. Hey, Zell! Ah, uh, Death, it's for anyone. You could teach Gaz something. Maybe he could teach you. And then you could both learn a lesson along the way about friendship. Hey, David, good to see you, man. How's work going today, man? I'm sorry, I kind of ended up passing out last night. How is Fall Guys? I was watching your stream with it. It seemed like it was kind of chaotic. Here, Phaedrus. I mean, obviously, I want to do these in good faith. You know, I'm not trying to, like, cheese the system. But yeah, like... I'm on a right now if one of you guys want to learn how to land fancy, or if you want some combat training through Pirate Swarm to unlock the pirate skins. Uh, Phaedrus, you can be a guide and get a guide. The thing is, you have to delist yourself to look at them, and then re-enlist as a guide once you want to be a guide again. Oh, David, I'm sorry. It didn't seem like it was fun, though. And good thing it's an admin day. Nobody busting you or anything. And, uh, Burger, you said it won't launch. Are you getting an error or anything? I know they were having some issues with the back end yesterday. Uh, sell kind of. The $45,000 missions occasionally do take you too far out stations, but it's kind of rare. I really wish they'd go back to the long distance halls. Landing gear down. 
Uh, yeah, Lotus, you can lose, like, an affinity, but not, like, the overall rep. And honestly, I'm not even sure what the affinity entails right now. Ah, <laughs> I mean, death, if you think about it, that is a guide right there, and that guide is don't get hurt, right? Yeah, motor? I mean, if you're available now, we could do some pirate swarm. Well, you know, Lotus, uh, they're getting an expansion with the illicit deliveries, supposedly, in 317.2. Uh, I haven't really got to do those deliveries because I've been working on my rep for... Uh, for the company that'll be doing it in live. Let's get low. High again. There we go. Easy peasy, lemon squeezy. You guys ever drink that Calypso lemonade? I bought some the other day because uh, the the bottles that comes in the glass bottles reminds me of Sobe. You guys remember Sobe? That like weird lizard milk stuff from like the '90s, early 2000s. But um, yeah, I bought one, and that stuff was really good. And I've been finding myself buying a lot of it lately. Ah, no worries, motor. Might do it later. Um, uh, Berg, I'm sorry, man. Um, I assume you've started it up multiple times and it gives you the same thing. What, uh, what are your PC specs? Do you know, like, your processor, graphics card, and do you have it installed in an SSD? And yet, sell. You and me both. That's one of the reasons I enjoy trade cells, because I can do those long hauls. And thank you, Pagan. I uh, guess, bear probably not. I might be doing the guide system. I don't know, I might. I might do it. You know, I got a little free fly going. I'd like to get that dragonfly referral bonus, but I'm not too, you know... I'm not too, um... What's the word? I'm not chomping at the bit for it, you know? Oh, 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 thank you, Squirrel. Thank you, Faders. You know, I got a couple of extra thumbs. I got them in a drawer somewhere. You know, Ghoulie, I only ever had got to have one Sobe drink. It was like this milky pink thing. And um, it was weird, but good, you know? And I had that when I had to sit at a store in Yellville, Arkansas for about six hours. Oh, Dad, what do you mean? I could teach you. Actually, tell you what, Dad, you know what? I will. Let's do a quick ad hoc training lesson. We don't have to be doing the guide system to teach, right? And yeah, Tarek, that's fair. Oh, Ducky. See, Ducky needs a referral more than I do. If any of you guys are going to buy the game, use Ducky's referral code first. Yeah, we'll do a quick ad hoc landing tutorial. We'll go low and slow. Oh, Sketch, I'm sorry. Oh, yeah, no, Dead, I do this all the time, man. I've got an entire tutorial that I've made on, uh, on how to land fancy. I mean, Dead, I could land this thing without even being in the pilot seat. But we'll do the tutorial part first. Yeah, Profeta, what issue are you having?
Uh, Profeta, check... Check your cart when you're in the store. There's not a chance that you've already got one in your cart, is there? Because that's what it sounds like the error is for. Ah, gotcha, Simon. Ah! I wonder. Hey, what, Profeta? I want you to do me a, a favor. Are you just buying, like, the War Bond package or, like, the basic package on the website? Like, the $45 one or what? <laughs> uh, Quetus, thank you. I'm sorry if I'm if I'm mispronouncing that. I know I get really bad at names. Hey, thank you, Dead Sec. Heck yeah, man. Thank you, man. Welcome on in. Ah, gotcha, Profeta. And you haven't you haven't already bought one, correct? Uh motor I have not. I'm usually not the combat guy. Like, believe me, you got much better combat tutorials out there. Um Thank you. Please, please. you know, Avenger One Uh oh gosh, what's the other group? What is their name? I wanna say there's an L. Ah, uh, gotcha, Profeta. Um... Tell you what, Profeta, I want you to do me a favor. Uh, if you got the internet close... Wait, what am I saying? I'm an idiot. Of course you're on the internet. You're... You're here. Um... Go to... Go to your... Account... Hangar... And then Billing and Subscription... And then towards the bottom, you're going to see some things that say orders. And tell me if there's any that have a status of like open or like in in the process, but haven't been paid yet. I'm wondering if maybe that's what you have. Yeah, Lotus, I always have to change to live chat. Oh, yeah, Ducky, that is... Yeah, yeah, Profeta, are you buying that on your son's account? Alright, so dead sec. I'm gonna, I'm gonna show you how to do this. So, the first thing is you want to make sure that you're lined up. So we're just gonna come to a, a stop. And, um... Let's just zoom in. Now, obviously, we're not lined up here. But you want to make sure that your vector indicator, when you go forward is going to go pretty much towards the back of the hangar without too much uh, leeway with you like strafing downward or up or anything like that. So we're going to do that now. And uh, generally as a rule of thumb, you want to put your crosshair usually at the very top of this landing pad circle. Now that is just for going into a hangar like this. If you're going onto a pad, it's going to be a little bit different. So we're going to go forward. And um, since I'm a little bit paranoid, the vector indicator for the caterpillar is always slightly off. But now we're going forward. And uh, you can go as fast as you want to. But we're going to go a little bit slow for this tutorial. And as you can see, we're going to approach. And we're going to stay like this just so we can maintain a visual. And we are decoupled right now. I did forget to mention that. Once you get up to speed, you want to make sure you're decoupled. We're going to be a little bit off to the left. So we're going to use slight adjustments while undecoupled to change our vector. Now we're going to slow down by feathering our space brake and keep turning to the right. And I'm not using Toby for this because I know not everyone has a Toby. We're going to speed up our rotation until we find our opposite vector indicator. And we're just going to line up on that. 
and we're going to stay there, and we're just going to trust that we're making it into the hangar. Once we get that collision alert, we know we're close, and then we're just going to slide on in to the hangar, trusting that we've done everything right. And once we pass that, we start to feather our forward thrust to slow down and let the natural movement carry us down. And that's it. That's how you do it. You want to make it look fancier? You just go faster. That's all there is to it. Oh yeah, dead. The Taurus can actually land fairly well like that too. You get a little bit of front heaviness, but uh, the Taurus can do just about any kind of landing like that. You might have to adjust some things slightly, but that goes for any ship. Hey, Johnny, good to see you, man. Uh, Profeta, you would actually have to buy it on his account. So, like, you could put your credit card on your son's account, but if you gift it to him, it doesn't count as him spending money on his account. So you'd actually have to log into his account, put your credit card on there, do the purchase, and then, you know, delete your credit card so your son doesn't buy an interest or whatever. Oh, Skitch. Are you running into that issue where it was like the account resets were keeping people from logging in? And yeah, Dad, the Connie series does like to do that. Yeah, see, Profeta? That's why you immediately delete that credit card. <laughs> you know, Casabear, I don't have a constellation, but I could go fix that right quick. Oh, Johnny, it's, uh, it's actually the very first drop-down menu. I'll show you. So, when you're in your advanced keybinds, vehicle seats, operator modes, open this. It is look behind. See, Des, that's why you immediately delete it after you, uh, after you purchase. But yeah, uh, Chibi, did you... Did you, uh, did you want to do a pirate swarm to unlock the pirate caterpillar? Yeah, Johnny. You're welcome, man. You know, Pagan, I never use that. I want to, but I just keep forgetting. Really, Ducky? Aw, oh, Joka, I'm sorry. Yeah, cause like... Oh, Joka, you only use the referral code when you very first make your account. So are you trying to put the code in during like a, a transaction? Cause that could be it. And Chibi, are you, uh, you're on my friends list, right? Yeah, Lotus, I think he does need a burrito. We'll have a we'll have a burrito. Gotcha. Uh Chibi, if you want, send me a friend's list or a friend request. And Chibi, would you like to chalk this up as a uh as a as a guide session? So you can learn some of the basics of combat while we uh do this and both get the Gladius skin? All right. Well, GB, if you want, I am currently in the guide system. Uh, I mean, you can find me under either combat, trading, misc, or the basics. 
trading would probably be the easier way, I don't know. I did change my profile picture on the website to the same box, so I should be able to hopefully be found fairly easily. Uh, Lotus, it was a subscriber helmet. Let me get into the light so you can actually see this thing. But uh, you can fish them out of random boxes, too. There is a green one and a white one as well. Uh, yeah. Give me... Actually, Chibi, if you give me a second, I'll just link you the guide system. <laughs> Which, really, they need to make it more obvious to get to. Because you have to make sure you're choosing, like, the right things just to get to it. Alright, I'm going to drop it in the in-game or stream chat. Yeah, Sketch, you might be running into the uh, that thing where it was like blocking people from being able to play. Ah, oh, there we go. There's Chibi. Go to session. Ahoy! Alright. Uh, Lotus, it's under the, uh, it's, you go to Pledge Store, there's an area to subscribe. Once you subscribe, you can actually purchase all of the past subscriber items in the subscriber store. Uh, Zeebo, only in very open-minded states. I'm sorry, I couldn't... I couldn't help myself, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, uh, I don't think you can, but, Zeebo, if you want, um, I mean... If you want in on this to, to unlock this the uh, the pirate swarm thing, uh, you're more than welcome. And uh, a joke is so far they have not. Sorry, Sibo, I couldn't help myself. But yeah, man, if you want in on this to get the uh, the pirate skins, um, I uh, I will shoot you an invite. Here, let me load up the main menu. And Chibi, I'm gonna send you. I'm gonna send you the uh, an invite. Uh, Fluffy, we are currently in the PU. The guide stuff. I mean, you can do it in either, but I feel like it's easiest to do it in PU. Ah, I got you, Sibo. Uh, are you trying to get the one for the Gladius? Hey, Zexy, thank you, man. Welcome about in. Yeah, Lotus. I mean, you could always find it in the box, too. And does anybody else want in on this Arena Commander for the Pirate Swarm Unlock? Uh, so, dead sec. Best way to do that would either be to request a guide or be a guide. Um, when you do the guide after you wrap up, the person who was guided can check mark all the boxes that they were guided on, and uh, both the guide and guidee will get the skin. So, if you want the one for the the Cutlass and the Gladius, you want to find someone or teach someone both the basics and combat. Uh, Chibi up to a certain point. Like, there's some big ships, obviously, you can't use. Um, actually, tell you what, let's just go to Arena Commander, because I don't remember if Party Invite actually works here. Yeah, Lotus, that's, that's true. Pirate Swarm. Alright, yeah, I'm gonna have to re-invite you all over again, Chibi. And this is where I have to sit here for 10 minutes waiting for my friend list to load because it's so big that the game locks up. Uh, dead sec, right now we are doing combat. Maybe the basics. I mean, technically Chibi can select all the ones for it afterwards. Uh, but I could always do it again. There we go. Oh, no. Guys, I think I might actually have to start paring down my friends list. Um, Chibi. Buddy. Friend pal. 
Is there a slight chance that maybe you could go to Pirate Swarm and then invite me? Maybe, just maybe. Yeah, that's all. Uh, that's like the guide things. If you're trying to get the skins, they're one at a time. Or, I mean, if you're trying to get the foundation skins, it's one guide at a time, I believe. I don't. I don't think you can accept multiples. Let me. Let me look. Actually, hold on. Let me just. Let me go look right quick. Yeah, pagan. It is rough, man. Like, do you know? Do you know how many? People I have on my friends list, it is a large number. Ah, thank you, Chibi. Let me just get back out to main menu and there we go. All right, now I'm in. Uh, tell you what, dead sec. Do you have the, uh, I'm going to send the guide thing. Look for me under trade. I guess. Look for the box thing. I'm going to see if it pops up with multiple sessions. I don't think it will, but, you know, can always check. Worst comes to worst, we can just do it right after, you know? All right. Chibi, give me a second to, uh, you know, pretty up my, my buck. Now I've got all this wreck that I never use. What does camera always says? Halicid. Oh hey. Sibo has sent me a guy. Ah, uh, yep, Sibo. Looks like it only lets me do wait, no, no, no. Okay. Sibo, I got it. I got it, Sibo. Uh, Chibi, would you be able to add Sibo? Just Charlie, Bravo, Oscar. Sibo. We could all do it together. As soon as I can find this other palisade. Yeah, Zexy. Sorry, Chibi, you might actually have to add multiple people. Uh, Lotus, you actually do it by doing Arena Commander, or, uh, becoming a subscriber. Sorry, Chibi. I am, uh, forcibly expanding your friends list. See, Des, that's what I like, too. Crumpet sometimes asks me why in the world I play things that you know, hurt me. And, uh... I understand the sentiment. But at the same time... I really enjoy doing that whole Chumbawamba thing, you know? Where I get knocked down and I get back up again. Oh, Robert! Crap! I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I, uh... I have actually upgraded... That graphics card, although honestly, that 1070 was phenomenal for streaming. Um, I'm actually on a 3080 Ti now. I am so sorry, Robert. I keep forgetting to update that page because I am I'm bad at. I'm just bad. We'll just steal that off of. Why in the world do I have a Misk Reliant Core A? But yeah, like that 1070, pretty much as long as I didn't go to Orzen, it was silky smooth right up to where it caught on fire. Which, incidentally, was not in, uh... Not in Star Citizen, it was while playing Iron Harvest. Alright. Yeah, Chibi, whenever you get Sibo... Uh... Alright, so we got Sibo... And... Ah, I got you, Zexy. Alright, nine minutes. Okay, I got you. 
Yeah, exactly, Des. And, uh, Sibo, you should actually get an invite here in a little bit. Ah, there we go. Yeah, add Mike. Yeah, Mike, we'll get you in here, too, and Zexy, we'll get you as soon as you're done. This won't take very long. Oh, Robert, I'm sorry, man. What, uh, how much RAM are you using? Yeah, dead sec, of course. But yeah, Chibi, if you can add, uh, Endless Mike. Hey, are you curious? Yeah, you've got the RAM. Um, I will say, Robert, the game is very CPU intensive. Except for the weather parts. Um... Yeah, 3600 should be fine. Might, it might be the 1050. Oh, Zexy, I'm sorry. Is it just because of the size? But yeah, GB, whenever you get endless mic, just go an Arena Commander and invite us all. Oh, yeah, Pagan, I didn't think about that, too. Hey, Dugan. Not bad. We're about to do some Arena Commander to uh, do some combination unlocking the Pirate Skins and the Foundation Skins as we do some combat training. And Cat, not yet. That'll get wiped when 317.2 goes to live. Yes, dead sec. Yeah, the Foundation Skins will be on your account forever. Now, the pirate skins, you know, if we're doing those, that's to be unlocked. We could always just do, like, regular missions in-game. Ah, no worries, Xy. Like I said, if we can get Mike in here, we'll knock that out right quick, because you can only have a max of four players in it, and then we can just run it through again with you, man. And Lotus, it's because they're super pretty spaceships. Mike, let me check right quick. I think I remember Crisis. If I could spell Crisis. We have a Crisist. Endless Mike SP, Endless Mike Hellstrom. Let's try Crisis. Ah, uh, yes, Cat, they are. Uh, Mike. Is it, um... Uh, not persist, is it? Uh, yeah, Brian. Uh, I've got a link for it in the stream description. It's not Endless Mike SP, is it? Because once I get in, I think I can invite you. Correct, Profeta. Uh, in fact, Profeta, if you go to your account, not your son's, but your, uh, your, like, your account, if you go to the referral area under settings, you'll actually be able to see, um, that you actually have him on there. There we go. All right, I found him. All right. Uh, GB, if you go ahead and make the arena commander room and invite us, I can invite Mike in. Actually, no. You need to invite him, probably, because, you know, my friends list is wonky dunk. But yeah, there you go. Yeah, add, uh, add endless space, Mike. Nightshade, which ones were you using? Yeah, stink finger. I feel like I've had a very unfortunate advantage going into it, you know? Like let's let's be honest. You are right, you know. Uh 
Ah, yeah, Nightshade. That, that could be it. It does seem to play quite well with NVIDIA. And Death, I don't... I don't know. I don't think so, but don't quote me. Tell you what, Death, um, if you give me a second, I'll just go start streaming on Twitch, then get a Twitter following, and then CIG will, you know, respond to me when I ask questions. I'm sorry, that was mean. They probably would if I actually, you know, <laughs> asked things. <laughs> Uh, Chibi, add Endless Space Mike. And then just go to Arena Commander and invite us all. I'm sorry to make you be the one to host this, Chibi. It's just my friends list is, uh... Well, it's at 587 people, and there's not even a search feature in Arena Commander. Uh, Sibo, you actually pick. So when we wrap up... It'll give you like a little two question survey, like one, did you play with this person? And two, what did they teach you in? Now, please, please, please do everything in good faith. Like we're doing arena commander here. So don't be like, oh, yeah, Jack taught me mining. Don't, you know, don't don't do that. Be be good. Uh, Chibi, I haven't got the invite yet. Ah, oh, Pagan, that is fair. Yeah, Lotus, exactly. Alright, Chibi, once you get that sent, you should be able to go to Arena Commander and invite us all in. And Death, I haven't got any of the skins yet. I don't think they're uh, handing them out just yet. They might be waiting until after the whole, you know, the whole event. Wait, Pagan, do you have a skin? Yeah, I don't have anything yet. All right, here we go. Ha-ha! <laughs> Drake, Drake, Drake. Drink, drink, drink. Ah, after the Foundation Week. Okay. Nice, Prophetic. Good to hear. I think your son will get it after the event is over. So it might be a few weeks. And yeah, Stink Pinger. Um, you only need the one, though, which is nice. That's really nice, you know? But all right. Sibo, bike. You guys just get your ships tailored. We're going to do some combat. Now, the trick to combat in Star Citizen, and really it's a, it's a founding principle in any sort of game with combat, uh, the trick is to shoot the enemy while avoiding being shot yourself. As long as you do that, you'll be fine. That's, uh, that's super important words right there. Shoot them as much as you can while minimizing all the times they can shoot you. Everything else is, is just fluff. I know, I am a... Brilliant tactician. <laughs> Lonix. <laughs> That's it. Do not die. Do not die. All right. Wonder what Sibo is going to fly. And once you guys have your ships picked out and, and customized, you sit the I'm ready. We'll go, go, go. Hey, Kai. Oh, Mike, we got this. We're going to get through it. We're going to be running up that hill. Yeah, Zexy, you got it, man.
Although, remind me. After after this, to go get some water. Uh, are curious we are doing pirate swarm to unlock the skins. Got a little bit of combat training in under the guide system. <laughs> I I don't even know if this works. Oh, it doesn't. I can't even type in the chat. The CIG know this. Tarek, I love the Buccaneer. Um, now, the thing is, the arrow is going to trumpet every single time. Uh, the Buccaneer is basically a spear. It is a freight train fighter. It flies forward with lots of guns really fast. It doesn't turn. It pretty much has to joust to, uh, to get in, do damage, and get out without taking a lot of damage itself. Now, in PvE, you know, like what we're about to do, it's fine. But um, if you're doing PvP, the only way it's going to survive is basically to joust. Um, the arrow is going to trumpet every single day of the week. The gladius is going to tear it apart. Um, it just does not have a lot of staying power once shields are down. And uh, it cannot survive losing pieces like other ships can. Because nine times out of ten, you're going to lose an engine. I wonder what massive ship Sibo could be putting together. Yeah, you see, the thing is, Tarak, when the buck was first introduced, most combat took place between three to six kilometers. Um, and the Buccaneer actually had, at the time, an incredibly small profile at three to six kilometers. Then the arrow was introduced, which was way smaller, and uh, the Buccaneer just cannot compete at those close ranges. Like, it was meant to, uh, it was meant to snipe, like it was a sniper, and we don't really have a sniper role anymore. Ah, uh, Sibo, you're good, man. You know, Arcturius, I wouldn't know. I barely fly the one that I bought, but I bought mine in-game. I also hate how clunky the weapon renting system is. Well, Stink, I mean like the, the forward profile. Like, you've got those massive engines, you know? Like, looking at it dead on forward, the arrow is very slim for, for height. Yeah, Tarok. Uh, Chibi, yes. There will be, like, little pickups you can pick up between waves. Uh, Jason, we're talking about the Buccaneer. Oh, serious. All right, there we go. Just waiting on Mike, and we are set. But yeah, like, the Buccaneer is a holdover from uh, the golden age of Star Citizen Combat. Oh, here we go. Here we go. I'm going to die immediately. <clears throat> See, they get to learn combat training, as in what not to do. I think I remember how to shoot things. Warning. There are multiple hostiles inbound. All right, where are they? Let me at them. All right, Thurston. Thurston Mabasa. Don't 
tell me that was it. You know, Spectre, that would be nice for VR controllers. Oh, there I go. Going too fast. See, that's what you should not do. You should always cap your speed when trying to furball with somebody. The Gatlings are an interesting choice. Nice! Yeah, there'll be pickups, like that wrench right there will repair your ship. I think it's green for the ammo, maybe blue? Oh yeah, Profeti, it's always- it's Profeti, sorry, Profeta. It's always fun to see what NPCs get up to when no one's really, you know, doing anything. And yeah, like the, the alpha damage on a Buccaneer, well, yeah, like I know it's NPCs. Oh, yeah, let's go find another Buccaneer. Why not? Mirror match. Come here, Alonzo. That's always depressing. All right. Also, Spectre, good to see you, man. You know, Tarek, I have not. I've really been wanting to mess around with one of those, but uh, I just keep forgetting to, you know? Problem with the Buccaneers, you take one missile and you are a lame duck. Like, they gotta put you out to pasture. See, Arcturus, that's a good idea. I didn't think about that. Because, like, you know, a 400 eye, you're not going to be in a lot of combat. But, man, the one time that you are... Whoa. Get off my back, get off my back, get off my back. Why is this thing still following me? How long is this missile going to be around for? There we go, finally. Moon. I mean, as small as Arena Commander is, we're all in a barrel, you know? Hey, Panthera, good to see you, man. 
And to be fair, most of these ships are auroras. Where do you even pick up the ADBs? Wait, Sibo, what are you? Uh, what are you in? You in the Scorpius? I guess I could target cycle and find out. Oh, he got something for me. I didn't get anything for him. Those indie bees I hear. I love those things. I wish that you could load up in multi-crew in Arena Commander. So you could actually have like a a turret gunner on that thing. Where is he? There he is. Ah! Yeah, I always forget about the ores in showroom. Oh, they got a three and five? Thank you, Arcturus. I hope I remember that. Wow, right out the gate. All right, Kazuma. No, thank you. I have to take my meds soon. Oh, which reminds me, I need to take my meds soon. <laughs> see. Come on up, Leo. Oh, that's a miss. All right. Sorry, try not to pass inside your fire there, Sibo. There we go. I mean, stink. You know, it's it's always a personal preference. I mean, I love my tin can terror here. You know. Love the silly thing. Is it the best ship for dog fighting? No. But I love it, and you know, it doesn't matter. I am chasing missiles. Why am I chasing missiles? Domino, I see your Gladius trail. Wow, like none of those hit. We got full power to weapons. They shouldn't be draining that fast, should they? Not draining, but charging that slow is what I mean. That was annoying.
Yeah, Tarok, I really enjoy, like, doing taxi rides with a phoenix, you know? Uh, Taco Dot, I think he did. Also, if I miss something in the chat, I'm sorry, guys. I am all over the place. You know, McNugget, you're not wrong there. I've done that a lot. All right, Cyril. Cyril might hit the station. Cyril is uncomfortably close to the station. Oh, I want that skin. Please let us have this skin, CIG. Back off a bit, let shield recharge. Nice! A Merlin! Are we really to the Merlins already? I didn't mean to pick that up. Uh, Connor, you can unlock buying the Vandal Glaive and Vandal Swarm, but for Pirate, uh, or Pirate Swarm, you unlock the Pirate Caterpillar and the Pirate Gladius. They're really chewing me up. How are you still alive, sir? There we go. Let's do that one last uppercut to the jaw. Get some more boost, shall we? Oh, no, Stinkfinger, not at all, man. I would barely... I might see him on radar. That's about it. Wait, I'm curious, an Aurora? What? Time to fade, heroes, till that shield gets back anyway. Really rotating with me, come on. I really miss like picking the uh picking the engines off those. Uh Panthera, sadly no. Oh yeah, plastic, I'm sorry. I'm uh in concentration mode. See, the thing about Avenger 1 is he actually knows what he's doing. I'm holding on to outdated glory days from the 2.0 era. And I refuse to give those up. Nice. 
All right, Buccaneer, come here. Let's have a mirror match. Hey, skill. Not bad, bad. Not bad at all. We're having a fairly smooth run. Ah, there he is. Or not? How many of these do we have hanging around that just aren't on scopes? But yeah, Zexy, it's just uh, six repeaters. Ah, there we go. Good job, Sibo. Uh, plastic, I'm using Toby. I quite enjoy it. And yeah, Plastic, you can still unlock the Glaive. It only comes up for sale during certain times of the year, but you still have to unlock it. Oh, Silvio. Do you guys ever watch a show called The Good Guys? Bradley Whitford. Colin Hanks. Bradley Whitford has this undercover character named Silvio. Oh, thanks, Coyote. Thanks, Kai. Oh, he's just sitting there like he gave up on life. Oh, whoops. Oh, I just let those get a bit more juice in them. Yeah, they got that guy. I think. Oh, that was fast. I'm sorry, what? Hold on, what is this? Why is he white? I'm sorry, hold up, that didn't... That didn't come out right. You know what I mean, like, why is there no... Weird. Ah, there it is. That's what I want. Ha <laughs> ha! Let's do it. Ah, Coyote, you got me there. You got me there. Ooh! They actually got accurate. I need to get close and hug. Nope, nope, nope. Time to fade, heroes. Granted, I guess those Merlins aren't exactly going to help, but still. Give me a hug. Come on. Oh, yeah, Zexy. You know, it's my favorite. Yeah, I'm gonna have to back out. Those Merlins are actually... Alright, come here, you. Whoa! How are you still alive? There we go. Where is it? Where's my... There he is. Yeah, I see Stink. I haven't really kept up with modern combat practices. That's another thing. Don't like how close to the station he is. Don't like that at all. We're 
going to back off from the giant cone of death. Because he is incredibly close to that, and I know I'm going to eat that. Oh, plastic, that's fair. I was very hesitant at first. Alright, he's away from the giant pylon of doom. Can do things now. Ah, I've lost my turret. Oh, I think I can get that. There we go. We just keep hitting him. Not let him recharge those shields. Although those Merlins are making things annoying, so we're gonna back off. Get shields refresh. Chibi no! Ah, stink, there's one right there, literally in front of me. I was just trying to get one without, uh... There we go. Yeah, Phaedrus, exactly. You don't have to wear anything on your head. You can do it with one eye in the dark. With glasses. Uh, no, plastic. You can play in uh, with no light whatsoever. It uses infrared. It's, uh, it's quite nice. There we go. I wish I could get a little bit closer. Ah, I got a Merlin on my back. Whatever. I'm not too worried about the Merlin. I'm a little worried about the Merlin. I should back off, but shields recharge, but I hate to break the circle, you know? Can't help but notice that I've lost my turret again. Oh, well. See if we can get a bit closer for this. Come on, fall! Fall! There we go. Alright, everything else is just clean up.
Yeah, you know, Terok, that's fair, man. It feels a bit too... I don't know, professional? Uh, Actrice, it is not. Uh-oh. Alright, Merlin, getting handsy. It tracks head and eye, but it does not track face. So, uh... If you're trying to do, like, you know, face reactions, things like that, it's not gonna let your camera do all that. You gotta disappear off my radar. Fine, I'll go for one guy I can target. Ugh, losing those two badges really becomes noticeable. There we go. I think we did it. Uh, Driz, yeah, this is Pirate Swarm. Unless there's one just outside of scanner range. Probably right there. Yeah, Kai. It's really nice. Like, all right, I'm gonna target with my eyes. Does that does that guy count? I'm just gonna shoot that thing. Actually, let's just shoot this guy because we know for sure that he's you know hostile. What is that awful sound? <laughs> I'm, I'm gonna go. See, we did that without reinforcements. Okay. I think we have to kill that weird thing. I'm just gonna do it. I think maybe the pilot died. Oh, that was friendly? Are you sure about that? We may have done it. We might just have to sit here for a minute because it takes a bit to, uh... ...the trigger at times. Also, sometimes... Oh, no, there we go. We got missiles. Turns out we still got some stealth people here. Nice. Hey, Darren. Good to see you, man. Where they be? Aha! There we go. There we go. We've done it. Now we just sit here for a minute. There we are. We have completed it. Good job, guys. Good run. Forget, do I just have to exit? Because I'm about to hit the wall anyway. Uh, talk or not, I would screenshot it just to, you know, be safe. But, uh, it should be automatically. And cheaper, not by that much. Although I'm going to exit back out to main menu now. Yeah, that was fun. All right, Zexa, you still need yours, right? Oh, boom, I'm done. And Sibo, I'm going to go ahead and end the session. It'll ask you, like, what all we did. I mean, obviously, I would say probably just either some combat or, or basics. I, I would probably just put on a combat. All right, Zexy, you want an invite? Oh god, hopefully I can find you on my list here. And yeah, what skill said? You can get it with store credit, no problem, but you cannot cross chassis upgrade to it. Yeah, sure thing, Zex. I mean, it's gonna take me five minutes for my friends list to load up here anyway. 
Uh, dead sec, we can get you in right now if you're trying to do this. Um, ah, there we go. Although, you guys might have to friend each other because I just realized I don't think I'm going to be able to use my friends list. Ah, uh, yes, skill, correct. Ah, uh, yes, Lonix, yes, it can. Yeah, okay, so my friends list has literally just locked up. Congratulations. Mm hmm. Hey, 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 hey. thank you. Like and subscribe. Thank you, man. Heck yeah. Thank you, man. Uh, Tarok, unfortunately, you cannot. So, you can only invite to Arena Commander from here. You can't actually join it as a group. It's a terrible setup. Uh, DeadSec, it could technically be a combination of both. We could do it as the guide system. Um. And, you know, also unlock the pirate skins. And did you, Zach, let me back out to main... I think, I think I've actually already got you. Yeah, Zexy, if you want to make the server and invite me, uh, we're doing DeadSec33. You said there was 33, right? Yeah, DeadSec33, all one word. Yeah, Nightshade. Now, you can buy it back in the, you know, unmelt section. Yeah, it's just my friends list is... Uh, Impossible to navigate in that system. Yeah, plastic, that's fair. Uh, dead sec, it wouldn't be a bad idea. Uh, that way you can get the skin. Or actually, um, Zexy, you need the skin, right? Like, you, you want the foundation skin. Zexy, dead sec, why don't you guys, uh, wait, why don't you guys set up as the guy? Because I've already got it, that way both you guys could get it together. Uh, Panther, you can have a total of four. There's going to be three of us. Uh, hold on, Zexy. Let me actually figure out. I, I just had him on my list. I'll, I'll look him up right quick. Yeah, Zexy, either you or Dead Sec should, uh, should be a guide and then find each other. That way you can actually uh, both get it, knock it out at the same time. Efficiency. Yeah, it's dead sec thirty three, all caps. I mean, motor. It's PVE though. It's totally different. Yeah, plastic. Just six months. I'm hoping they increase it because that's literally the only way to get the Pirate Caterpillar, unless you did it the very first month Pirate Swarm came out, which was then a zero-cost CCU skin. You got him, Zexy? All right. Give me a second. I need to get some water. I will be right back.
Oh, thank you, Moon. Sorry, yes. Thank you, Moon. I, I am muted. My bad. I am so sorry. Yeah. Uh, Moon, I promise I'm not ignoring you. Uh, yeah, Zexy, DeadSec, if you guys find yourselves on that guide page, Moon, I promise I am in the process of, uh, of taking my pills. I've just swallowed one. That's two. Oi. Oi, oi, oi. I hate this stuff. Three. I think that was three. Ah, uh, yes, Dead Sec. The guide and the guide E both get the skins. And yeah, I mean, I was listening to you. Sorry, I just, I didn't realize that I was still muted, so I was just yammering away to no one in particular. Ah, that's four. Now, uh, where in the world did I toss that bottle of Losartan? There you are. Uh, Zexy, probably. I'm sure we can get someone. Uh, Zexy, dead sec, doesn't matter who hosts it, but go ahead and go into Arena Commander and invite each other and, and me. Uh, Sibo, all you have to do is wait. You get the pain after the event is over. And Knight, I don't believe you can gift the skins. I believe they're account locked, like the best in show stuff. All right, there we go. I guess they're going to the exact same one. Oh, wait, nope. Nope, sorry. Uh, yeah, Zexy, just invite Dead in. And yeah, we're doing Pirate Swarm. I hope we're doing Pirate Swarm. Join Dead? Okay, all right, yeah. Dad, we'll join you then. I'm sorry. Ha <laughs> Oh, whoops. Sorry, guys. Yeah, Dad, send me an invite again. And does anybody else want in on this? Anyone else trying to get the pirate skins? Mm-hmm. <laughs> Also, the guide session does need to run for a minimum of 30 minutes, just so you guys know. It should take that long just for us to knock it out, but, you know, giving you a heads up. I don't know you could use these. I feel like that would go very poorly, since they've nerfed them into the ground. I'll just rock my buck. I like my buck. A buck, buck, buck. Anyone else? Going once. Going twice. Uh, dead sec, if you go to select or rent ship, you can just select any of the ships that you own or one of the loaners. Oh, I'm sad that I can't use a, a 600i. 
Wait, no, I can. Ooh. Ooh, 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 ooh. Uh, no, no, no. I'm going to. I'm gonna. I'm gonna be nice. Oh, mate, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Panthera, I really want to. I really want to, but... <laughs> Tarak, that's fine. But, you know, you don't have to need the skin. You can always join in for the funsies. Uh, Motor, do you want in? I'm not actually available on Guide right now, but I can turn it on right quick. Yeah, Motor, I'll turn it on. And Skill, I'm sorry. Alright, Motor, it's on, man. Uh, Dad, if you want to add him, or Zexy, if you want to add him, it's Motor Hero, all one word. Ah, you're still working. Okay. All right. All right. Well, I'm going to disable my guide thing. Hit I'm ready. And uh, whenever you guys are ready, we can go on in. Uh, Saron, you can have four. Saron, you want in? You want to get a guide skin and a pirate skin at the same time? Uh, Dead sec, how many ships do you have? Uh, Zexy. Ah, uh, yeah, you're right, Zexy. Maybe I can invite. That's the, uh, that's the guide thing. for finding the guides. Oh, fair enough. All right. Yeah. Tarok, if you want in, if someone can back out and then get re-invited in. Oh, dead sec. That's fine. You can use the 300i. We got you, man. We will we will carry. Hey, Black Moon. I would invite people in, but uh my thing likes to explode whenever I try to use my friends list. Which is not the best, you know. Yeah, it's your thing, Zexy. Appreciate it. Like, I need to pare down my friends list, but I don't want to take anyone off of it, you know? Hey, Raymond. 20 minutes actually sounds like a long time. But good to see you, man. Yeah, Giant Toad, we're pretty much doing it to get the, the guides and the pirate skins at the same time and teaching combat. Uh, Zexy, we're inviting uh, Helio Strike. That's Tarok's name. Helio Strike, or Helio Strike. Hey, Anthony. And then once we knock that out, I'm going to go back to live and fly around. Maybe do some more guide stuff. Uh, Raymond, you don't. PTU friends list is entirely separate from PU friends list. Which is both a blessing and a curse. Uh, Zexy, I'll type it out. And Tarak, I'm not gonna judge. I judge things like... If you put your cart back or not, you know?
Yeah, Raymond. And Raymond, they lowered the amount of guides you need. Uh, it's now one for each uh, each thing. All right, we are in. Select your ships. We'll go, go, go. Oh, Black Moon, it's pretty fun. And Strass, um... What is your... What's, what's your specs? Because it's very CPU intensive. But yeah, you only need one guide now in each thing. And both the guide and the guide E uh, get the skin now, too. Yeah, Zexy. I mean, I like the pirate cat because people go, ah, oh, cool, pirate cat. Uh, yes, Raymond, yeah. Uh, Tarok, you should have at least one ship. I mean, if you go in, I think it'll just choose a default ship that you own. What happens if you try to ready? Oh, Panther, I'm sorry. Yeah, okay. Ah, the G-Hammer. And Strauss, those actually should be giving you some pretty... pretty wizardly frames right there. Uh, Tarek, back out of that screen, then hit it again and just sit there. It might need to populate. I think I've had that issue from time to time. Oh, yeah, Strauss, if you hit 32, you'll, uh, you'll get a lot more, uh, I say a lot more frames, and generally it, it behaves a lot better, you know? Uh, Gigantoad, they're a very smooth brushed metal and teal. Like, uh, Gigantoad, you know that 400i skin, the Meridian skin, that's, like, very reflective steel color. It's that with teal accents. They are beautiful. Oh, Tarok and Ready is grayed out. Oh, man, I don't know. Um, What happens if you go to single player Arena Commander, Tarok? And yeah, Dragon Toe, they are incredibly beautiful. Ah, Tarak, yeah, Zexy said he had to reset his account. Uh, Kai, if that's the case, do you want in here, Kai? I'm sorry, Tarak. Say what, Kai? I'm going to make myself available for guide. And I'm going to look for you here, if I can find you. Alright. While I'm finding you... Yeah, I put myself up on the guide thing. Uh, Dragon Toad, just for some ships. Seriously, why, why are these not in an order? This is so badly done. Like, how, how hard is it? To, to order things. Yeah, I'm sorry, Tarok. I'm sorry, man. I 
I don't know if these invites are actually going through. There we go. There's Kai. Ah, yeah, Phaedrus. Uh-oh. I think I've broken my game. Ha! Ah, I did. I did. I just crashed the desktop because my friends list is too long. Yes, Logos. Yeah, one guide for each thing and both people get the skin. Uh, I'm sorry, Zexy. Dead. I'm gonna need an invite, and you guys will have to add Kai. Kai, could you type your name in the uh, the stream chat so one of them can add you and invite you? Did we lose Dead Sec? I swear they make it so hard to get any sort of group thing done in this game. Account login failed. Did all of you guys crash? I'm going to log out, log back in. Ah, thank you, Kai. Ah, uh, yes, Logos. I mean, I would do it in good faith. Like, you know, at least do the type of thing that you're doing. Don't shoot something and say they did, you know, mining, touring... FPS, trading, all that, like, would definitely do it in good faith. All right, try this again. Uh, Zexy, he did. He put in Achilles' crash and burn. See, I would invite him myself if I could. Ooh, whoops. But my friends list dies in Arena Commander. All right. Yeah, Zexy, when you can, just send me one. Or dead sec, whoever's hosting. That's it, Panthera. That's it. Dead sec, can you not ready up at all? Like, can you not use your 300 eye? Hey, Dustin. We're trying to set up a uh, a session here for Arena Commander, but it is having some issues. And own ships aren't appearing. My God, Arena Commander, how could you be so bad? Well, Kai, we could always do some in-game missions or knock out Arena Commander with you, me, and Zexy. Dead sec. I'm sorry, man. Let me just see if I can actually select ships. Okay, uh, yeah, I can still select ships. So yeah, things are working for me. Okay, there's Kai. Ha <laughs> ha! 
<laughs> Locos. <laughs> I wish I could say so, Logos, but we both know. We both. Ah, uh, dead sec. Well, if you and Zexy want to be able to knock that out later, you guys totally can. Um, the three of us can go here too. Fifteen minutes. All right, dead sec. Yeah. Well, the three of us will just knock this out. Get a guide in for for Kai. Yeah, Zexy. I think so. And then I want to get back to the space lanes. Yeah, that's like, yeah, you guys can do that. Just make sure you get to play with each other is all. You know, this map is beautiful, but I never play on it. Oh, Tavish, I'm sorry, man. There are multiple hostiles inbound. What, uh, what GPU? Contact. Okay, that's what I'm gonna have to change. Give me a sec. I know he's shooting at me, but... It's the... The stupid one-liners they like to use that freeze up my game because it forces to comms. I'm just like, come on, guys. Whew! Is it always this bright on this map? Like, this is bad. Ah, uh, yeah, Strauss, it's the free fly. Yeah, Strauss, they give it to everybody. Newbies, old bees, in betweenies, beanies. Yeah, 1080 should be fine. I was playing in 2K and streaming on a 1070. It's actually, it's fine, man. I'm just never on this map. Alright, Cliff. Come on. I think the dust really throws off my uh, perception of movement, too. Which isn't necessarily a bad thing. It means you have to pay attention. But, oh, is flight visibility just not a thing on this map? Seriously, you can't see anything. Oh, Tavish, I'm sorry, man. Uh, Tavish, what si or what uh, what city did you start in? That might actually be a lot of it too. Because if you can uh, reset your account. 
and choose something like Area 18, that might go a little bit better on your system. It might also be good to spawn and then just lay in bed and wait a few minutes without doing anything. Get off my backside. How much fuel is in this missile? Was it Orizen? Yeah, Tavish. Orizen is the worst possible place for graphics cards. Like, seriously, you get out of there, I think you'll find things actually work. Because that place is just graphics card hell, you know? Yeah, Babbage is okay. I find Art Corp to be the easiest on me. Yeah, like, or isn't or sucks. I'm sorry. Like, it's pretty, but it is not worth it, you know? All right, Harold. Not signing for it. Harold, come back. My god, what are all those? Who is... Ugh. That is a lot of missiles over there. Oh, they're headed my way now. <laughs> nice. Mr. Abdul and the Cutlass. How much is that Cutlass in the window? Congratulations. Is Where is he? Uh, stress the, uh, the tractor beam. That moves boxes and stuff. It doesn't move you, though, unless you're already in zero G. Hey, Brian. Yeah, man, I'm still on. Working on the railroad. Hello, Grigori. Goodbye. Gregory. Yeah, James, we're doing a combat guide, Guy and I, and also unlocking some pirate storms or pirate swarm stuff. Contact. Yeah, Brian, how was Dallas? Where's that miss? There he is.
don't know why I'm sitting still. Ah, yeah. And James, that sounds nice. Man, I, I miss, I miss drinking. I really do. Just having a Long Island iced tea and getting all bubbly. And singing things out of key. I mean, I do that anyway, you know, but it's nice to be drunk to have that as an excuse. Uh, Strauss, you literally just shoot it, but you can't actually use those in Armistice Zone. Wow, oh, it's really out the gate with those, aren't they? Also, Star Wars, good to see you, man. But yeah, if you're an armistice, they just won't work. Pierre? Hey, Gaz! Give me a second, Gaz. I'm getting shot at, then I'll read it. Ooh, she's saying had a little bit of a oomph from the tank. Oh, yeah, so they not sponsor my stream. Whoops. Well, their people can contact me and I'll just you know, grovel, apologize, all that. I mean, if you think it's, it's free advertising, you know. Uh, Garbear, there's been an issue with that that they've been trying to fix. Uh, when is the last time you tried to claim it? You might have to do a character reset if those are even working at the moment. But they've been having a lot of issues with back-end services involving character resets, ship claims, all sorts of stuff. Nice, thank you. Here he is. Like, I know I've got a Gladius on me, I just don't care. Uh, Garbear, can you claim the free fly ships at all to your current location? And use those. In fact, where is your original ship? Or is it just destroyed? How in the world are you still alive? There we go, finally. And I think Kai's on that guy. Ah, there we go, we'll hit the Merlin. He's coming to me anyway. Hey, 
Hey, Driz, how was the tour? Ah, that's a constellation. I should have paid attention more. I like that they gave these things a lot more health. Player ones especially needed it. Time to fade, heroes. Nice. What is this white thing? Oh, that must be his Merlin. That's what I was having issues with earlier. There we go. And these things love missiles. Circle this a little leisurely while we're uh, getting our boost back. Garbear, if that's the case, I might look at doing a character reset. Where's this guy going? He's gonna die. There he goes. Now he's recovering. Because that was an issue they had on the back end, and I think they did a hot fix for it, but I would definitely look at uh, resetting your character to clear up some of that stuff. Hopefully this database reset will clear up a ton of that noise. I hate that these guys have infinite ballistics in Arena Commander. No, Dez, they fixed that issue with a back end hotfix. Yeah, they, they already dropped a f hot fix for that a couple of days ago. And yeah, Logos, I wish we could get that. I really wish we could get a red Connie skin for that. <sighs> is there another Merlin? Yes, there is. Oh, look at me, I'm super tiny with an infinite Gatling gun. Mosquito. We got a Gladius. That's elite, huh? Uh, Driz, I'm currently in the Buccaneer. Unless you're not talking to me. My bad if you're not.
Nice. Yeah, a little tin can terror. Missing a few pieces now. How are you still alive? Nice, Terra. Good deal. Didn't drop a wrench, did he? There we go. I am missing a fan. Death trap, Mark Two. No. No, no. Uh, Driz, I love the buck, man. This is my default for Arena Commander right here. And most, uh, most combat missions. Uh, I've got a Merlin chasing me down. All right, let's break off for you. Hello, Hammerhead. I'll deal with you in a little bit. I don't want to deal with a Merlin, but I really can't afford to be chased down by one while circling the hammerhead, so. Nice, Zexy. All right, now I can circle the hammerhead. Maybe not. I hear all those Merlins coming in. Let's just back up. All right, where are you, buddy? I hear you. Hey, loudest. Like every single time I try to get in close to this hammerhead, the Merlins remember that I exist. Hammerheads remembering that I exist too. go we're getting into the meat fall fall
Nice. You know, I wish I could shoot through the gap on the hammerhead. I'm not that good. I can't aim like that. I have to get a little bit closer. And uh, let me tell you how much the buccaneer is terrible at uh, dancing around the hammerhead. This is uh last guy, isn't it? I hope this is the last guy. I have missiles. Let's try one out. Ah, that's why I don't use missiles. Nope, that's not last guy. There's there's still quite a few. That's fine, that's fine. You know, Panthera, I would take that. Or at least like a double cat situation, you know? fuel do they is there fuel entering the command they're like can you pick up more fuel is that a thing I usually don't go for the pickups all right i need you to get off my back All right, my goodness, I think we've done it. Sorry, now I can catch up. More fuel is a thing? Okay. Got most of my parts, too. Probably a little bit of engine damage. Yeah, Taco, I saw that. Oh, I see those missiles going off, so that means we probably have one more that I'm not seeing. There we go. There's our guy. Ah, oh, they got him. They got him. Nice. Oh, he's making that weird sound. Good job! We did it! Whew! Yeah, Garbear. That's what I would do. Good job, everybody. And I would screenshot that to make sure they, uh, just in case it says, you know, you didn't get it or whatever. But now you should have the pirate skins unlocked for purchase. And, uh, I think, Kai, we can wrap that one up now. Kai, I hope you had some fun with combat experience there. So I'm going to go ahead and close that guide out, Kai, and it's probably going to give you a, uh, a what do you call it? A thing. Like a quick survey. Oh, Kai, did you have ballistics? I'm sorry, man. There we go. Ah. Oh, that was fun.
Zexy, I'm sorry about that, Connie. It will definitely uh, do some damage. It actually has surprisingly decent uh, turrets. All right. Let's get back into it. Yeah, Zexy, you're welcome, man. Although I could use the, uh, the relaxing hauling and touring now. Yeah, Raymond, there's two different maps. Hey, dead sec, welcome back. All right. Yeah, dead sexy. If your ships are working, nice, sexy. Hey, man, you have to forgive me. My my Cyrillic is is terrible. Uh, death, I'm probably about to reopen for trading. Let me just take off vehicle combat. I do need to do touring. You can tour while trading, can't you? Alright, we are open for trading. Really, guy? Wouldn't let you fly a car too? Oh, that's weird. Whoa, that guy's neck. Yeah, death, of course. Oh, Adam. Yeah, man, I'll be around next week. Everything all right? Hey, Seb, good to see you, man. Welcome to the ASOC vehicle retrieval system. Happy Friday. Indeed, it is a warm Friday. Yep, guide request is back up. A nice dead sec. There's a death factor. Idy ho, death. Death, would you like to join me in game? And yeah, dead sec. The uh, the arrow is good. I would swap the guns on it. I would definitely go from ballistics to energy weapons if you can. Visit you got it, death. Uh, Garbear, I mean, it could just be specs. Like, I'm running it in 2k. That's it, Logos. Oh, Adam. Good on you, man. Heck yeah. And Kai, you can, but I don't think it lets you select the same, like, selection thing at once. Uh, yeah, Death, in the PU. If you want, just send me a, uh, a party invite. And then if you can, make me leader or something. Or if you want, I can just send you a party, or, uh... Hopefully, party invite. Yeah, guy, if you want to try, um, looking me up in the guide thing, check under trade. Uh, death, I am currently a crew L1, but I can go on to Tresler, trade around Microtech, teach you about the dangers of trading around Space Canada. Uh, Casabear, that is the, uh, the chat sounds that Spectrum makes. I'm trying to find a way to mute it. I don't think you can, though. I'm sorry. Welcome to the ASOC vehicle retrieval system. It's 
pretty up the kitty cat. Goodbye. Oh, that's not a bad idea. Caterpillar, 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 caterpillar. Uh, Kai, what about under touring? Is, is touring available? Welcome. Ah, not a bad idea, Adam. And no, gee, it is not. Your vehicle has been it is not. Anger six. Oh yeah, Garbear, are you on an SSD? Yeah, Adam. That's good on you, man. Kidneys are uh kidneys are important, you know. Really, Kai, that is weird. Cause I was able to do multiples earlier. And it still says I'm available. Look under misc or just basics. Oh, Garbear, that money came from various people. We're about to have a wipe, so... People like Keel and... Pagan and everyone else have been quite free with their money. Yeah, Zexy, thanks for coming along, bud. Even better, Death. I will head there. Hey, Baylor. You know, I love my caterpillar. <clears throat> you know, Baylor, I can't wait to make this the, uh, that shiny skin with the teal. Hey, Akala. Yeah, yeah, especially when you're in a group. Makes it a lot easier if, uh, we're gonna crash the desktop. And hey, Julio. Yeah, Kai, try refreshing it and doing it again, because it still says I'm available. And I was able to do multiples before. Uh, Kai, I did change my uh, my profile picture on the website to match the uh, the box, so it's no longer the sad, depressed bird.
Hey, Profeta, no worries, man. Well, you know, Baylor, it doesn't really matter how many hours you've got. You can always uh, do it, and both the guide and guidee get the skin, Baylor. And hey, Kyle, thanks, man. It's, uh, here, I'll link it to you. I'll link it. I think I've still got the same thing copy-pasted. It does not. Hold up. There we go. So, basically, you gotta sign up to be a guide or look for guides. And, uh... As long as you do one guide, you get the skin for whatever section you did the guide for. Both the guide and the guidee get it. However, you do have to spend at least 30 minutes in the session. And please do it in good faith. Don't just check every single box once you wrap up. Because it'll ask the person who was guided, like, if you played together and what all you learned from them. And, like, if you just signed up for combat and all you learned was combat, don't check that you did, like, you know, touring, trading, mining. friend here. <laughs> but yeah, Kyle, there are some pretty skins. Now, we don't get it until the event is over, but you know. Also, do you guys remember Fruit Gushers? I bought some last night and I forgot how disappointing they were. Yeah, Randir, I noticed. That was, my God, that was a day. That was a day. And Bailey, that's fine. Although I think for the guide thing, they want you to actually play together. Wow, Sab, I haven't heard of Neko wafers since... since... the 90s? And that one time I saw Hedwig and the Angry Inch? Oh, poor Death. Trying to get that coffee. I mean, Sav, you get a break. I'm not, I'm not grilling you or anything like that. Yeah, Dad, I would say so. Yeah, Driz, Star Marine is a whole other experience.
I think good old Star Streams is gonna have to do some Star Marine to get that uh, that Valkyrie skin. Yeah, Sarod. Sarod, you would work. Sarod, do you need a guide? There's a million and two guides out there. Please proceed to sign landing bay. Which ones are you after, Sarod? Uh, so Driz, if you, uh, if you look at the stream description, there should be a link for the Founders Festival thing. That'll have all the information about, uh, what ships get the skins and whatnot. Ah, oh, Phaedrus, I didn't think about that. Ah, oh, yeah, Logos, yeah, you'll get splattered across the wall. Oh yeah, Seb, these? Yeah, they did a really good job with the switchback armor. Please proceed to sign landing. Uh, gee, they are pretty stable. Usually the Arena Commander and Star Marine stuff are incredibly stable. Because you only have to worry about a few people. Like, when you've only got four people in a very small arena versus 50 across the solar system, then, you know, things get, uh, get a little bit easier. Eh, nothing fancy. We're just gonna slot the battery today. Alright, Death, try, uh, try Hangar 7. Yes, there is, either one. Oh, yes, yeah, Ron. I mean, technically, you could knock those out all in one go, as long as you play long enough with someone. And go do some mining. You can get the Cutlass Black one for, uh, for just the basics. MSR is miscellaneous. You could teach someone how to land fancy. That's what I did with Crumpet. Taught her how to land without even being inside the uh, the pilot seat. I was so proud of her. And later, she's gonna take me mining. There goes death. There's- oh, sorry, death. You might have to hit that again. Oof. My camera does not like that. Hey, Bart! You had fun? Good, but I'm glad to hear that. Uh, Garbaric can be a thing if you if you know what you're doing, or if you don't know what you're doing. Either or, really. And Baylor, we could, uh, I mean, we could put that under miscellaneous, right? There you go, Logos. Alright, Death, you riding with me. You want, you're you here to learn. You want to learn. Yeah, Squirrel? I have like some sort of... Like radio... A little clip, you know? You're listening to Star Citizen Streams. See if I was like, uh, if I was doing medical stuff. That'd be fun. You're listening to Galactic Emergency Medical Services. Your nurse, 
in the verse. Oh no, Garbear, it's easy. It's easy, I'll show you. There we go, Baylor. I'll have 30 large McMuffins with extra mustard. Uh, Ayu, this is the Drake Caterpillar. Kind of hard to see since it's just, you know, nighttime. But uh, it's the cat. It's probably my favorite ship in the game. <laughs> Baylor, I mean, okay. Baylor, that's fair. I've been learning how to do this stuff since 2.0, but Crumpet learned in the span of 30 minutes. So, I would say it's actually quite easy to learn. Tell you what. Tell you what, Garbear. I'm going to go land on a moon without being in a seat. How about that? Yeah, Death? You and me both. It feels like a beautiful tube of toothpaste. Oh, yeah, G. I mean, actually, quite a few ships can handle like that. The Buccaneer can't. <laughs> Pantera. Uh, Driz, I taught her to do uh, regular decoupled landings, reverse landings, and an unmanned caterpillar landing. At a station. Next, we're going to probably work on uh, on unmanned at a uh, at a pad. All right, Garbear, I'm gonna do one on a planet. These are usually the slightly more difficult ones. They're not as fancy because you have to minimize your speed. I find the Cutlass to be an excellent trainer ship for teaching landing. Because since you can ride in the co-pilot seat, you can see exactly where you're headed and, uh, you know, offer play-by-play. -play. Oh, Death Faction, I ain't gonna kill ya! Yeah, see, now it's daytime, so we can see it a little bit better. And it is a beautiful skin. Baylor, why scared? We're actually going to be going at a fairly slow pace. We'll be landing around 22 to 17 meters per second. Profetti could easily have a relationship like that. All right, so, Gar. First thing you want to do is make sure you line up for what you're looking for. Hey, Reckless. So, for example, we want the larger pad because we're going to be sliding a bit. We can't approach from this side because there's a bunch of poles in the way. And, uh, while I'm more than willing to wrap myself around the pole, I'm not going to do it on stream. Uh, Kim, there is a free fly at the moment. However, eventually you would have to, like, purchase, like, a, a one-time game package. Right now, it is PC only. Yeah, Profeta. Uh, Lee, what were you looking for? So, yeah. Uh, Baylor, we're going to approach from this side, and also, with something like the Caterpillar being so large, you want a fairly shallow angle. Um, since this thing is rather long, we're going to go for a 5 degree or less angle. So about, about right here. It's probably going to be alright. And we actually have to use cruise control when on a planet. That way, we can continue moving forward without being in the sea. So once we actually have our uh, our angle set up, we're going to very slowly set our cruise control and max speed. Now you're going to notice we're doing about 7 meters per second, which isn't too fast. And we're going to increase that uh, probably, probably right there. 
15. Yeah, 15 is good. And we're aiming just slightly beyond the, uh, the pad. And our approach is not adjusting, so things look good. And we're going to do it right there. We're just going to get out of the seat. Uh, Driz, no, not for planetary. And now, if you're doing it in space, you do want to be decoupled. Come on, death. We'll watch from here. There we go. And I probably should have came in at a shallower angle, but I think we'll be all right. The larger ships are a bit more difficult to do this with. Cutlass makes it easy. Ah, uh, yeah, I'm sorry, Elite. Yeah, I'm the 18th. Oh, 25th. Nice. So, yeah, we're actually coming in here. See, it evens out. And we start coming to a stop. Now, I was kind of a bit further out than I probably should have been. I don't think the rear legs are actually on the pad. What's up, Baylor? You didn't you didn't like that? Let's find out if the rear legs are on the pad. I don't think they are. Okay, so they're just barely off. So I should have actually aimed further back. But you get the gist of it. And again, with something like the Caterpillar, it is a bit more difficult to pull off. So we're going to actually go back and try that again. Ah, it was a bit messy, Baylor. We're going to fix it. We're going to fix it in post. Death, I like that get up. Yeah, exactly, Baylor. Actually, I probably should have gone faster since I was at a five degree angle. If you go less than five degree, you're going to go slower because of the slide. All right, so. Decouple, let that go. Honestly, Profeta, practice. What you guys don't see is a lot of the times when I go, hmm, I wonder if I could do that. And then I try it. And when I fail, I go back and I try again. Then I make adjustments. So what we're going to do now is we're going to aim a little bit higher up. Probably right there. Same speed, about 17. We're going to see what that does. Although I might be aiming too high. But again, that's how you find out. Uh, death, there is no cargo yet. We are empty. Maybe that's it. Maybe I need cargo to make it, you know, work. Yeah, see, that's too high. I think we're actually going to overshoot and uh, actually hit that stuff. I could be wrong, though, but I'm pretty sure I'm I'm going to smack. Yeah, see, we're already close, and uh, we're not even over the, uh, the pad. So a lot of it is trial and error and getting things just right. So we came in too high there. I am, however, going to ride this out and eat my own, you know, consequences. Wait, ghost boxes? What? Hold on. One, consequences. What do you mean, ghost boxes? Well, you know, Elite, if you do the most of a particular section, you actually win the ship, too. I know you said you don't want them. What's in here? I don't know what I'm carrying. I didn't know I had cargo. Ah, well. I'll land and then I can check what I actually have in here.
Yeah, gee, the poles in this game are invincible. All right, so we're going to go for that again. Maybe meet in the middle. So, let's go five degrees. Maybe less than five degrees. Aimed at the back. All right, five degrees, vector indicator. The very back of that, eh, maybe slightly higher because we're at less than five degrees. Thinking about the caterpillar, it likes to slide on its own, too. All right, we're going to see what that gives us. Yeah, Raymond, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Raymond. And that's a very rough approach. I think the rear landing gear are going to be off again. Yeah, we're dipping in transit. I want to know why. Yeah. The rears are off again. Yeah, honestly, Logos, I think that's it. I think most of it is just confidence, because if you fail, you just go, oh well, and try again. Oh, Prophet, of course I'm you, bit. <laughs> you think I just woke up one day being able to do all that? No, it's practice, Beth. Anybody can do this. And yeah, Elite, the wind is definitely a serious portion of it. Yeah, same thing. Think about the Caterpillars, you just have so many landing gear, you know? Yeah, gee. The caterpillar just pulls itself down, honestly. Ha! <laughs> Raven! <laughs> Alright, death. You're gonna learn some trade. So, death. I've got in the hold currently a load of Agricultural supplies, which means we're headed to Shady Glen. That means we cannot sell this here. Ag supplies can only go to a farm location. Yeah, gee. Because another thing is, too, once your landing gear starts hitting the ground... You lose all of your thruster power except for up. Ah, we must have hit the same button. Yeah, I'm sorry, Raven. I'm sorry. I need to figure out why it's listing. Yeah, Elite, have a good one, Ben. All right, let's go for Walla. Always good to also ping your surroundings to make sure no sneaky weasels are waiting for you. Tell you what, we'll uh, we'll do it for Shady Glen. We'll do a Mr. Magoo landing, where we can step off as we're landing. How about that? No landing pad there, so it doesn't really matter where we land exactly. Hey, Sofu. Hey, Infinite.
All right. Where's my shady glen? There you are. And it's going to be nighttime, of course. Yeah, Dragnos, that's actually what I'm wondering about. Yeah, Infinite. Where'd you fall down? Profeta, I don't have a schedule for that. Is that... Is that a thing? I need to pull up. Sorry, I got to reading and... I got the first rule, which is... Fly first, read second. All right, where is Shady Glen? Like I'm either on top of it or ah, I am on top of it. Yeah, Logos, that'll be nice. Can actually afford to pay escorts, you know? All right. Which side is which? There we go. All right. Can use that. So we're going to do the exact same thing. And try to get low. <clears throat> Sorry. I think right about... Yeah, right about there should do it. Death, you got that med gun on you, right? We just... Mr. Magoo? Ah, oh, we hit the rock. Ah, oh, well. Oh, good. You survived. Way over there. <laughs> Did you take any damage, Death? Oh, good. Like, I heard the little ping thing go off. Thank you, Raymond. I thought I was going to catch myself on the uh, on the turret and just, you know, splort. Well, just in case you do get hurt, I'll pick up a, uh, a medical gun. There should be one in here. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, 
uh, Dragnos, you know, if the paycheck is juicy enough, I think it'll attract people. Hey, Silas. Alright, death, we're gonna ship this cross country. Hey, no worries, Silas. You get that referral bonus. I'm still trying to get one myself. All right, death. We're gonna take this one. To, uh, I don't know. What do you guys think? Microtech, Lorville. Honestly, Dragnos. As long as you had one or two. To be able to peel away the uh, either the E impulse or the mantis stuff. <laughs> Baylor, hey, if I was in Berlin, I'd probably hit you up about that. Oh, Raymond, no, no, no. I definitely would like to, uh, to say that they are not required. They just make things very, you know, fun. All right, Death, let's go on a tour to Space Canada. Oh, Microtech. Uh, Panthera, he means the, the guide page. I've got the guide page. Give me a second. That there. Uh, dead sec, what categories are you set up for? That's right, death. To Maple and beyond. You know, I just realized something. I missed the entirety of the steam sale. Ah, oh, well. Whoopsie doodle. I also really hope when 318 comes out that they expand the uh, the fuel tank of the Caterpillar to be at least similar to the C2s. Because uh, there's a lot of unused space in this ship. Yeah, Panther, select those. Look for Dead Sex name. It'll be Dead Sex 33. Oh, <laughs> Raven, you're fine, man. But yeah, like, there's a lot of room back here that's just not used. Like, you have a lot of room back behind this. Behind this, that's just not being used at all. I'm just gonna assume that might be, a you know, a fuel tank or something. But we also have all these down here. Yeah, Terry, what is that? I haven't heard anything about that. And then... Whatever these are. Like, are these are these quantum fuel tanks? What are these? I mean, dead sec, I'm excited for it. I think it'll be a nice, much more aggressive, you know, constellation series. Well, yeah, Baylor. I mean, like, the big things here, like, these are... Hold on, let me get back here. These are the engines... But what are these things, you know? Like, they look like they have tanks attached, like they're doing, you know, fuel tank things. Death Factor is your spine, like, spinning around. Ah, yeah. I bet on Death Factor's screen, his, sp like his spine is just 
spinning back and forth. Look at that. Feet buried inside the, uh, the floor. I'm just gonna back away. Uh, Profeta, I might be. I kind of want to keep doing the trade ones to see if I can win the, the Caterpillar. But I don't know if I should just not and let someone else win a Caterpillar. Uh, Dolan, if you do exclamation specs, it'll show you. Death, is that... Is that your gun? Did you put a gun in there? If it works, anyway. If it doesn't, I'll list out the whole thing. See, Death, I'd like to win the cat. I want to be able to have all three of them. Oh, Death, I don't think anyone gets to have the gun now. I can't grab it for anything. It is melded in there. Oh, what? I didn't realize it was empty. Ah, oh, well. We'll be fine. We'll be fine. That's it, death. How close are we? Oh, we are pretty close. All right. Poor guy, T-posing. Ah, <laughs> gold. There's always the secret gun rack down here. Ah, yeah, those are, uh... I'm never getting that back. No, what? Nope, nope. There was a brief moment that I had the ability. There we go. Uh, infinite, I have not yet. Was that something they showed off today on the uh, on Star Citizen Live? Yeah, I miss those entirely. Can they be uh, can they be deployed inside ships? That's the big question right there. Yeah, Arcturius, the 400i has always been amazing for that for me. No, Leo, I will. We just jumped across the system. That, like, ate the entire thing. It, uh... Hey, the, the Caterpillar has a very tiny fuel tank. Tell you what, Death, we're actually going to land proper. For fun. And also because I need fuel.
Yeah, Silas, what have they what else have they been doing? Have they actually just been playing instead or what? Ah after playing together. See that's the way to learn right there. That's just uh, to do it together. You know, JM, I think you're right about that. Oh yeah, so that was, what's that? See, Silas, it sounds like you guys should, uh, should fly a constellation together so you can have a, uh, a parasite fighter. <laughs> and disco chainsaw on the prospector. I'm sorry, Silas. I'm sorry. I'm not sorry. I'm a little sorry. Yeah, Sab, you didn't like that? Oh, Death, you are an expert trader. But basically, if it's a metal or mineral, it needs to go to a a city. Same thing with a vice, or a legal vice, anyway. Agricultural supplies will always need to go to a food-producing outpost. And scrap needs to go to Her L5, Crew L5, Arc L1, and Mike L1. Probably in that order. Yeah, Raymond, you got me. Oh, did I request one? Wait, Death, what are you doing? That's not... That's not how you become a traitor. You gotta make money as a traitor, not, not lose it. Oh yeah, sure, Infinite. Let me, uh, let me pull it up here. Here we go. There you go. Sorry, I didn't have a, a corny joke to go along with it. Oh, thank you, Death. It's weird that you're putting me in, like, the weird Avenger Tower. Ah, you're welcome, Infinite. Well, we don't have a lot of snow. This should be a fairly easy entry. Or not snow, but uh, weather. What we do have, though... Is a banana peel! Well, I feel like the snow started up right when I, uh, decided this was a good idea. It did. Blowing me off course. Ah, good old new Babbage snow. I feel like that was a 4 out of 10. Oh, death, you crashed? Oh, no. He's really on that, uh... On that screen. Wow, there is no collision. No collision whatsoever. Oh, look, we can look at the, uh... 
the inside of these uh, these models. Neat. What does that say? E46, DFJ, Nito, Torpedo. Sorry, Death, I'll try to rescue you. By that, I mean store the ship. Death, whenever that happens to me, I have to log out of the, uh, the client and launcher and manually log back in. Whoa. Whoa, sorry, hold up. I'm feeling the, uh... I think I'm feeling my meds now. Took them a bit longer to hit. Yeah, Raven, exactly. That's it. That's it. How's it going, man? How's it going? Yeah, sorry. Usually it, uh, they hit a bit quicker than that, but... I guess my body is still getting used to them. It's only, what, the third day? The fourth day? Did you guys ever see, uh, what is that movie called? The Sixth Day with Arnold Schwarzenegger? I think that's what it was called. I could be wrong. About the clones. Oh yeah, Raven. I just gotta remember to take him tomorrow. Uh, Hengisha, it is my, uh, my kidney not die medication. The stuff that is $20,000 a month that, thank goodness, I don't have to pay for. But, uh, it's four pills a day, plus my Losartan. And, uh, for whatever reason, you cannot have grapefruit with it, which is how it goes for most medications. Uh, negative Mesa, we're actually on live. I've been doing live just so I could do, like, the guide system stuff. And yeah, I was you didn't, uh... Didn't think it'd be good? Skipped out on it? I mean, that's a fair cop. We're gonna drive the mule. Actually, you know what? Maybe we'll take a dragonfly. You guys think I could survive a dragonfly over to the other side of New Babbage? Yeah, Sab, it is, uh, it is expensive. It is literally the only drug in the world. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Hold up. I'm on drugs, but not... Not that kind of drug. Um... Well, Death, I don't think I got a choice, man. <laughs> um... Wait, what is, no, no, no. Did you guys see that? There's like a magic, what is that? What is the magic Borealis door? Yeah, with their, me and elevators have met. Yeah, infinite. Come on, let me out, let me out, let me out! Let me fall through something. My goodness. I feel like I'm so close, and yet... Maybe... Maybe if I... Or if I dance... I see Uther I want to. And Mesa, which one is that? Was that just using sit a whole bunch to go forward? Yeah, I'm curious. I think I'll just have to do that. Ha! 
<laughs> Mastodon. I. Oh no. Oh no! Well, there's no getting to me. Oh yeah, you know what, Boris? I think that probably would have worked. Oh, it says I'm going to be rescued. Let's see what happens. Let's see. Let's see what happens. It said I was going to be rescued. I think it lied. Not up. Oh, I'm waking up. Thank you, Vic Vector. Hey, Ola. Not much. I just suffered a catastrophic accident. And look, all my junk's here. Oh yeah, Macedon. Uh, they they talk to you in like the big cities. I think specifically Microtech. Oh, actually, I could probably use that in the gun. Eh, I'll just reload once I get out of town. Yeah, Silas. Like, oh, this guy again. There we go. Now I'm suited. And this guy is... Dude, what? What are you... Hey, Igor. Alright, we've learned our lesson. Back away from all elevators. You know, Infinite, I should. I should. Sadly, I'm probably going to have to wrap it up soon. Because it is getting about that time. Death, do you feel like you've learned something about trade? And had a decent tour of the uh, areas around the Arcorp moons and the Microtech? Now, where in the world am I going? Yeah, death, it was fun, man. I'm gonna go ahead and end the... the, uh... the guy thing. It should give you, like, a little survey. Right, I need to go to the commons to sell this stuff. Careful. Doors are now uh, Blaster Boy, I'm on a new set of medicine called Tarpeo. Turns out it is not pronounced peyote. It is Tarpeo. I got those two mixed up in the beginning. Uh, but yeah, it's uh, the first drug out to treat... A condition that I have called IGA nephropathy. Ah, uh, yes, Raymond. I did. That's why I'm headed to the commons to uh, to sell this load of distilled spirits. Man, I hate all those lights. I hope they they do something about those lights. Oh, thank you, Agala. I gotta say, though, frame-wise, that is probably the smoothest train ride I have ever had. I don't know how well those transferred over to, to YouTube, but uh, that was actually pretty silky smooth. Yeah, Igor, it'll be whenever 317.2 goes live. I don't 
don't think I can sell the gown at the TDD, can I? How many janitors they have for this place? Like, Microtech or New Babbage always feels so weird. Like, it's so. Whoops. Clinical, you know? Yeah, infinite. That's probably the way to do it. Ah, yes, Arcturius, of course. Oh, this thing actually rotates? Neat. Uh, Raymond, it has a few... Issues with hangups. Especially when you crash the desktop. Oh, that poor guy has a box attached to his hand. She gets to deliver it. Let's let's see. Yeah, Lodix, have a good one, man. Ah, Silas. <laughs> There he is. Ah, Silas, that's not a bad idea. I hope he doesn't think I'm I'm being weird. I mean, the Mustang box add-on, too, is amazing for 317.2. Now you can actually carry boxes in that thing, you know? Okay, Boone, that's fair. I get it. I okay, you got a you got a fair cup. Hey, Long Dash. Uh, we're back in PU.
Tell you what, we'll, we'll take our arms off. There he goes, you got it unstuck. Unstuck, unstuck. I mean, honestly, you can just wear them if he wants to. There he goes, look at him, he looks fancy. Ah, thank you, Randir. See, ah, yeah, this way. Just grab that. Ah. Nice, Phaedrus. Welcome to being off work. I oh oh oh. Oh, that's a lot of undersuits. Yeah, Prophet, I have a good one, man. Good luck with the drive home. A place animation. Come on. Hey, Explodo. Long time, man. How you doing? Pat Mac, I think we all are, man. I assume you're looking to uh, to find someone to use your referral code, correct? Yeah, man, not so bad. Not so bad. All things considered, you know, I, uh, I'm on the new pills. And, uh, I don't know if they're helping yet. They haven't hit as hard as the old stuff, but man. They are, uh, 
And you do give me some of the dizziness and the the fog, uh, the fog brand, you know? Yeah, Raven, have a good night, man. Honestly, I think I'm gonna take this uh, this caterpillar back to Krill One and wrap it up for there. Whoa, sorry. Wait, did I go the wrong way? I did. Hey, Hunter, welcome back, man. Thank you. Good to see you, man. How you doing? We want the spaceport. Although I do feel like the trains in New Babbage take the longest compared to anything else. Capsule now approaching station. Stand clear of disembarking passengers. Oh, Haunter. Oh no, man. I am sorry to hear it. Is there anything that can be done? Sorry to hear it, man. No chance at all. Because... <sighs> that is awful. I'm sorry. Tell the kids to give the money back. Until he's go do something fun. You know? Ah, get a... Embarrassing tattoo or something at least, you know? a bone marrow man hunter i am sorry to hear it i i hope you can at least enjoy yourself man i'm i'm sorry it's an awful thing no one should have to go through that uh yeah john yeah, uh, free fly is on right now. Sorry, I saw I had a ending. Whatever someone sent me, it's gone now. A 
Yeah, man, Hunter, I'm I'm sorry. I know that's rough. But yeah, John, we've got the the free flies going on right now. And I've got mm, Prospector, MSR, Cutlass, a couple of fighters. Hey, Muzz. Morning, morning. Hey, James, no worries, man. Things are going all right. Did a couple of guides. Mostly uh, for Arena Commander combat. But... Actually about to pack it up. We're going to refuel this thing and take it back to, uh, the Creole one. Yeah, Hunter, what's, uh, what's your favorite alcohol? And exploring probably not till November. I could be wrong, but at the very worst, it'll be November. Yeah, the 600 eye stuff, I mean, they might have them for sale earlier. I know it's getting a rework, but it probably won't be till next year anyway. Uh, John, if you, if you already have an account, you have them automatically. If you check the stream description, I've got a link to the, uh, the free fly stuff. <laughs> hey, loyal. Not bad, man. Done a couple of guides today. I think I'm gonna try to grind some trade guides out, see if I can win a caterpillar for this whole thing. Thank you. And Hunter, I feel you there, man. I I feel that. Yeah, Jack, you should give it a, a try. Dust it off. And Muzz, what, what would you want me to sing? Oh, Hunter, really? Is that... Is that because of leukemia? And yeah, Loyal, although I'm going to be wrapping up here in a few minutes. I'm basically just getting back to, uh, to Crew L1 so I can wrap things up. Ha! Ah, some Aqua. I don't know if I could hit those notes proper. Ah, gotcha, Hunter. I gotcha. Uh, Missy and Mystery, the guide thing, if you, uh, open the stream description, there's a link to the Foundation Festival stuff, but basically there's a guide system where you can kind of sign up to, to help people learn various parts of Star Citizen, like mining, you know, combat, trading, basics, miscellaneous, things like that. And, uh, right now, if you do the guide system, both you and the person you, you guide... We'll get a, uh, a ship skin for the corresponding ship associated with that. Um, and if you're the person who's done the most in that particular category, then uh, you actually win the ship in addition to the skin, which is rather nice. 
You know, Loyal, I actually don't remember the lyrics to that song. But yeah, there's one for the Caterpillar, 600i, Galadius, Arrow, Cutlass, Valkyrie, I'm trying to remember the rest. And Jack, that's fair. And yeah, John. MSR is, uh, oh yeah, that's it. Star Runner's also on there. Yeah, exactly, Explodo. Like, you know, there's a link to the guide system on the front page, but, uh, just looking at it, you would never know where it was. And yeah, Loyal, I wish you could get that for the Merchantman. I'm really excited for it for the Caterpillar, because all the skins are going to be that uh, super reflective brushed metal with teal accents. That's it. Thank you, Saron. Feel bad. I always forget about the Prospector. Yeah, Jack. But yeah, we're gonna pack this up at Cruel 1 and end the stream for the day. I just I hate to wrap up at Microtech because it's, you know, Microtech. And yeah, uh, Missy, Mr. E, the skins are unique just to the guide program. I think you've got two weeks to earn them. You only need to do one guide in each, uh, each category. So if you want a Caterpillar skin, you have to do one trade guide. And both you and the person you're guiding get the skin. Now, you don't get it until after it's, you know, the thing is wrapped up. Yeah, exactly. Explodo. Like, it should be easier to... to find. Yeah, Hunter. Man, have a have a good one, man. And good luck with it. At the very least, I hope you can have a a half decent weekend, you know. And Loyal, you're probably right there. It's just weird that they make the link for it three tiny arrows. You would think that those would just be decorations for the front page. Like, it's just so hard to find. Yeah, sure thing, Hunter. Did a lot of arena commander, getting the uh, the combat basics down. I'm glad they're expanding the skins though, because previously when they announced it yesterday, you had to have five guides just to get one skin, and. Uh, that meant spending a minimum of 25 hours doing everything, and that's not even including the amount of time it takes to get someone to, to take you on as a guy, you know? Yeah, 
Yeah, I don't knock something back strong for me, man. Hey, dark side. Thank you, man. And yeah, Buzz, I wish we could actually get hex codes. Uh, John, no idea. What are they? What are they doing? Do you just mean like for the respawn? Hey, Dragon Master. Oh, John, uh, they're actually not bringing that feature back. They were only temporarily able to spawn people. Sadly, they've been relegated to not having that feature anymore, and that is a permanent thing. And yes, Sinister? It is a fun game. And parts are finally getting cheaper. Yeah, John, uh, they're actually not going to have that anymore. It was only a temporary thing. They could do a lot better about showing that, because even on the, the sale page for it, it says that they can still respawn. But yeah, that was actually a, a temporary thing, sadly. And basically, the, uh, the Cutlass Red is supposed to be a sort of ambulance system where it can repair small things or at least stabilize you until it gets you to a hospital. That's basically it. It's just basic, uh, basic repair or basic medical. Like, it can fix some basic things, but it cannot respawn. Which, believe me, I feel the same way. The Apollo is supposed to fill that role, but who knows when we're ever going to see that, you know? I mean, when it first came out, like, when it was sold, that's what it was sold as. Like, it would not be able to do, like, you know, respawns. But uh, they sure did let it have respawns for a long time and let people get used to it. You know what? I'm just going to trust that door to be open by the time I get there. All right. Hey, thanks, you. Or, or should I go you? Long you. There we go. Let's go long you. And yeah, Explodo, like, I'm still waiting on all the hex code stuff, you know? <laughs> Thank you, Sinister. Uh, actually, Missy Mystery, I'm actually just using mouse and keyboard. Nothing fancy. Mouse, keyboard, and, uh, and a Toby for looking around. Thank you, Uther. I think I'll keep hiding myself out in the mist guide section to teach people how to how to land fancy, you know? Hey, guitars! Oh, guitars, I'm about to wrap up. I'm sorry, man. I'm sorry. Ha, ah, thank you, Silas. I mean, you know, John, I don't care too, too much about the realism, and honestly, I feel like when it comes to spaceships, a lot of them would be controlled via, via a keyboard style, you know? Like, I don't know if you ever watched the Orville, but, uh, Gordon, or whoever's piloting the ship when Gordon's not around, they actually fly via keyboard, you know? Now, I know that's more advanced than Star Citizen flight, because it's more, you know, high-technology, uh, Star Trek style. 
But yeah, I love my keyboard. Ah, Muzz. Yeah, Silas, so stream elements has been weird today. But all right. Yeah, Explodo, have a good one, man. I'm actually about to wrap it up here now, so enjoy yourself, man. Guys, we're going to go ahead and call it here for the day. I appreciate each and every one of you showing up and talking to me and hanging out and doing some of the guide stuff with me, so. This being the weekend, you probably won't see me until Monday. I, I might stream, but if I do, it'll be random. I wouldn't count on it. And, um, so yeah, most likely look for me Monday. So I want you guys to, one, stay cool if you are in the Northern Hemisphere, because it has been hot lately. Super hot. Drink plenty of water and uh, enjoy yourself over the weekend. Be nice to yourself and enjoy yourself. Um... Seriously, be kind to yourself. And that's it for Saken. And lurking. I appreciate all you lurkers, too. Seriously. So, guys, please have a good night. Enjoy yourselves. Be kind. Good luck doing the guide system if you're trying to get all the skins. And until next time, keep on trucking. Have a good night, guys.